back step. Going to Mordor alone. Of course you are. Then I'm coming with you. We've got two minutes left on the ads and then we will get going.
The only problem with listening to this, it just makes me want to watch Lord of the Rings again. Which isn't a problem, but still. Extended editions or go home. <clears throat> I think we should rip. Bum ba dum ba da dum ba dum bum ba dum bum bum ba dum I have so many things to say to that Scarlet, but I guess I won't for now. I still think I fucked up the angle on my camera, but it's fine. Bum. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> Hello, everybody. How are you doing today? Welcome into the stream. I apologize for the lack of streams. Technically, normally Monday and Wednesday are my days off, but took an extra day this week and I, I needed it. I really needed it. I, I was not kidding when I said that I was dealing with a, a bout of depression. I am definitely through the fogginess now, so that's good. But I was not in ripe shape the last couple of days. But I am feeling better. Uh, so, yeah. I almost... <laughs> Scarlet, congratulations on the first redemption. I don't know what I was about to say, but it was going to sound stupid. So, you're cool. No, you. Eh. No you. Fuck. You on. Oh my god, I forgot about the scare alert. Nope, those are going off. Hang on. Fuck that. Nope. Vegas fixes all depression. Yeah, I'm sure it does. Um, hang on. I'm changing that. I was supposed to have streamed Evil Within yesterday, and I was going to change it afterwards, but I... Didn't stream yesterday and completely forgot, so that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> good job, you got a good scare alert, Kevin. Um, but they're going away! Stop it! I saw that one before it triggered, because I could see the, the thing. Hey on, stop playing alerts! I'm fixing you or me. <laughs> You're faster! I hadn't even opened it yet. One second. Don't give me bits, I'm turning those off. CD. Yes. Hi, Patty. Um. Okay. Save that. Oh, it didn't even. Hang on, Corpins. Hang on. I, I want to at least. It didn't trigger the um the other alert because of the way I have the scare alerts. Hang on. I'm, I'm gonna fix yours so yours plays. One second. One second, everybody. At least I again. I the one positive thing. CD. CD, CD, CD. Hey, C CD. Are we there yet? I still need to add the what is it, the declined one or whatever, and Rube's follow, um, which I call it one. Okay, hang on. Corpins, let me see if I can replay yours now, and it'll. Aha! There we go. <laughs> I wanted to hear it. That that's like music to my ears. <laughs> Any of the, I think it's 10 bits to 99. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Thank you for starting a hype train. <laughs> I was just trying to get the scare alerts out. <laughs> okay, I think I have it fixed. <laughs> I think everything's fixed now. Okay, um, real quick. Thank you, Kevin, for the 100 bits. Viffy, thank you for the 500 bits. You were faster. Patty, thank you for the resub. Wait. Uh, two. You get two. I had to remember. I couldn't remember how I did the maracas nowadays. Patty gets two maracas. Two mini maracas. 13 months. Thank you, Patty. I appreciate you. Thank you, uh, Corpins, for the 77 bits for luck. Viffy, thank you. I think it was 50. Was it Viffy? Yes, Viffy for the, the bits for... Uh, it's weird how it shows up in the activity feed sometimes. 
for the 150 rube bits and emmy thank you for the 100 bits i appreciate it thank you for the hype train and being silly now i'm gonna get back to catching up and chat because we're not going to be late streaming today or playing games today are we um i'm sorry herbie i'm sorry i had to do it so late weekday streams still like i can choose to change the weekday stream streams <laughs> don't make me late to play games uh, I, I'm trying to do it. <clears throat> I haven't streamed in a couple of days, so we, we, we got to get to some gameplay. People want the gameplay. <laughs> Self, thank you for the five gifted subs. I appreciate you. That gets a Baraka too. Thank you, Self, for the five gifted subs. I really appreciate it. Even if y'all are just trying to make me late. <laughs> Rube, thank you for the 75 bits. I appreciate it. Um, where was I? Uh, I'm assuming that's Kevin. It is Kevin. <laughs> I have to look over there to see where, how far it is. Kevin, thank you for the 200 air horn bits. I appreciate it. Thank you all very much for supporting me. I, I appreciate it. Man, I feel like I have so much to talk about already. And I don't want to be... If, if I go over 30 minutes, I'll switch to just chatting. But I'm like, no, 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 no. I don't need to go. Because I can, I can just chat. <laughs> Emmy, thank you for the 50 applause bits. Why are we applauding? Okay, I'm going to start reading chat. Don't make it longer. Um, I laughed at Scarlet and Rube's interaction at the beginning. That was cracking me up. I'm not going to lie. The thin ice though thing made me laugh, especially because Scarlet lives in Canada and for some reason it just made me laugh harder. Ariane, welcome in, good to see you. Mediterranean has backed out of the room, fair enough. I don't blame you. Hello, Miss Petite Colossus, how are you doing? It's good to see you. God, don't force me to leave. I didn't force you to read Lord of the Rings at all. What are you talking about? I did not do that. Uh, Nez, welcome in, hope you're doing well. You're not late. Dig down deep, hello, how are you doing today? I'm not used to seeing you on the, the late nights. Well, late night for you all streams. But Dig, I hope you're well. Snuggle Bunsy, good to see you. Uh, Where Badger, hello, I hope On the Road is treating you well. We can totally watch Lord of the Rings again in December though, that sounds like a plan. Like extended, extended things, so, yee. Scarlet, I, I wanted to say, if you've never seen all of the Lord of the Rings movies or any full Lord of the Rings movie, we've, we've got an issue. Instead of watching The Boy and the Heron, we should have watched that. <laughs> Although if anybody hasn't seen The Boy and the Heron, um, the Studio Ghibli movie that came out, what, two years ago now? Um, that thing was a fucking mind trip. And uh, I feel like I've never, <laughs> let me <laughs> prep this. I've never been on acid, but I feel like that's what it would be like. <laughs> That was like the most wild Studio Ghibli movie. Like it was all over the fucking place. And like Studio Ghibli is, is really good for, for the record. I like a lot of Studio Ghibli movies. Um, but that one was just like so fucking wild. I don't know. It, it was it was good. I, I, ended, I ended up liking it. I wouldn't say it's one of my favorites, but uh, it was just kind of a crazy trip. So... Um, but yeah, Llama, Scarlet, and I watched that yesterday. I don't know. I didn't go to bed until 6 a.m. So, um, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense, Scarlet. I forgot about that. I've seen a bunch of clips and scenes. Fair, but we still need to watch the whole thing then. Uh, Corpins, how are you doing today, by the way? It's good to see you. We're going to be raiding some tombs today. Uh, da, 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 da. <laughs> I know I'm also fine with Ghibli, but Lord of the Rings is going on that list. I agree. Oh, I'm sorry to hear you're not feeling well, Herbie. I hope you feel better quickly. Hello, July. How are you doing today? Hello, Robco. Good to see you, too. I hope you're well. Kevin, hello. Sending all the po positive vibes. I appreciate it. I was just in a rut the last few days, uh, beating myself up over some things combined with mother nature's bullshit and like just some other stuff um quite frankly the election didn't help either 
but we don't discuss politics around here. I will say one note on it though, uh, not on the politics side of things, just the human rights side of things. And I don't give a absolute fine, fine fuck if, uh, good, the train can end so we can get to gameplay fast, better, faster things. Um, is that, uh, the train is ending a god. We obviously don't talk politics in this channel, and there's two reasons for that. Number one, I'm not the best source for political information, so I I think a lot of you all know I don't go into conversations I don't know shit about, and so I don't touch it, and I don't believe people should uh, listen to my opinion <laughs> over going and doing their research. And number two... I typically don't like stepping on people's toes and I'm a people pleaser, so I say do your own thing. The exception to that is that we have rules in this community and they state no racism, no bigotry, no bullshit. This is an inclusive place for everyone to be. There's 9,200 people that visit this channel or has visited this channel, which means there are people from all walks of life. I know for a fact all the different representations this community has. So I will just state that people are human beings, every single goddamn one of them, and you will be welcome here, assuming that you are not a bigot, a racist, or otherwise. Uh, that being said, this community will continue to be that way, and if people try to invalidate the sanctity of having a good place to just hang out with people of all walks of life, then they'll be removed. It's, it's as simple as that. I want that to be known. Uh, I believe that everybody should have equal rights as long as they're not hurting someone else or themselves um, then they they should have rights to live their life the way they want to so that is how I live and that is my moral code and if anybody disagrees with that they can get the hell out because this isn't the place for them uh, outside of that I will just say that we'll continue to have a nice place where people can come and hang out Hopefully not have to worry about the worries of the world for a few minutes, a few hours of their day. Uh, and that's really all I'll say on the topic at this point. But just know that you all are welcome here. And if somebody ever causes grief, then uh, myself and the mods will like to know. Other than that, I'm very happy to have this community. And I think at least for the most part, this community does an extremely good job of, uh, of being supportive from one another. Um, just a lighthearted story is one of the coolest things that I saw was uh, community members who had never interacted with before with each other. I saw them following and leaving comments on each other's Instagram posts and stuff. And it just like kind of re like made me feel good about like the fact that this community has made connections not only between me and you all, but between each other. And it was just like, I don't know, it just made me feel a lot better knowing that you all have become friends with one another or that you interact with one another. And that that's, that this space is the place that, that made that happen. So I just wanted to share that and I appreciate you all. Uh, Vippy. Thank you again for the 500 bits. Patty, thank you again for the 13 month resub. I appreciate it. I heard Huff and Buff fixes depression with big wins. The problem with that, Rube, is that you win the Huff and Puffs. I won one Huff and Puff. This is going to sound so out of context because nobody has a fucking clue what we're talking about. And the more I'm talking about it, the more I realize it doesn't sound like what it sounds like. But, <laughs> um,. <laughs> Huff and Puff is a slot machine. <laughs> and uh, like one of my only big payouts when I was in Vegas, and I say big payouts, it was like, I don't know, 50 to $70, um, was on a Huff and Puff. And then like the rest of the week that I was in Vegas, I was doing terrible and Rube was doing great. Rube just kept raking it in. Like he came up positive, almost better than I came out negative. <laughs> But it was so funny. His luck in Vegas was insane. He'd sit down on a machine and get like bonuses. And I'm just like, what the hell? So obviously we're just having for like fun. Um, slots are just, you know, time wasters. Get a few drinks, slots, all that good stuff. But uh, yeah, Rube, Rube won a lot. Like he he was winning in Vegas. I was not. <laughs> I was the problem, problem child. <laughs> I was not winning. But uh, <laughs> the Huff and Puff thing is really funny. It is a really fun slot machine. So 
Corpins, thank you again for the 77 bits. Biffy, thank you for the 150 bits. DJ Killboy, hello! How are you doing? It's good to see you. I just wanted to send some luck your way. I appreciate that, Corpins. Life is what it is, and we'll just keep moving forward. Emmy, thank you for the 100 bits. I appreciate it. I broke everything? No, I took the scare <laughs> alerts away, Dig. No more of that. Self, thank you again for the five gifted subs. That's very kind of you. Thank you so much. 46 gifted subs to the channel already. Thank you very, very, very much. Uh, to Hannah, to Misha's mom, to Highlander, to True Individual, and to Little Dude. Congratulations if you got gifted a sub from Self. Uh, if you're here and not in a heavy lurk, please make sure to thank them. That was very, very kind of them. Uh, we do play games around here. I know, wild, wild concept. Rube, thank you for the 75 bits for the horn. I appreciate it. Coffee! Hello, Coffee Scroll. How are you doing today? It's good to see you. Chubbs, welcome in. Good to see you as well. Kevin, thank you for the air horn bits. Robco, I'm going to go ahead and open the link so I don't forget. Oh, thank God it saved my cookies this time and it's in dark mode. Thank God. Okay. <laughs> Now entering Yapville population, she is CD's chat. It fluctuates. <laughs> Llama, hello. How are you today? It's good to see you. I saw you over in John's. I have John's screen. You can't really see it. It's not showing on my face, but he's uh, he's currently playing Cuphead. And I really wanted to watch him play some. And it's fun to see John like really get, I don't know, excitable, I guess. Like he's more like a chilled, very laid back person. And so him getting excited is really funny to me. I love it. John is wonderful. If you're not already following. More thizzle, faux shizzle. Cause goddamn his name is so long. Please go drop him a follow. John's wonderful. Um, Where was I? Paula, hello Paula. How are you doing today? Good to see you. Oh, does Llama need to cook food? Cook your food, Llama. What are you having? I remembered a thing, maybe. Ooh, you remembered a thing. What's a thing? I need to see that. It was, it was interesting. I kind of want to rewatch it already. Yeah, it, it was very, very interesting. Like, I feel like I would watch it again, but I feel like there's a lot of Studio Ghibli movies I need to rewatch or watch for the first time. There's plenty I haven't seen yet. <laughs> Rob go. <laughs> oh my God, I'm not reading that out loud because somebody's going to clip it. Didn't I tell you not to stay up late? The night before I stayed up till seven. Actually, no, was it 7 a.m. last night? I think I slept from seven to one. Depression's a bitch. Oh yeah, the Neil, I mean, Colossus, it was fun. It was a fun watch. I will agree with Llama and Scarlet, it felt kind of slow in the beginning. And so, but like when it got into things, it was just a fucking fever dream. <laughs> It really was. Rube, thank you for the 100 bits. It's okay that the train ended. It's okay. I appreciate you all supporting me. Yes. Touch chat hallways, now politics. Exactly. Lean on one another. I am doing better today, Robco. I am doing better today. Hi, Glass Joe. How are you doing today? I'm perfectly happy to win slots. I'm sure you are. Are we getting buffering? Oh, Lord. I have no idea, I don't see any buffering, but. God, Twitch has been such bullshit lately with her stuff. I has no buffering, but. Is anybody else? Canuck says yes, July says yes. I don't see anything on my end. But y'all let me know. I, I see nothing on my end. No connection issues, bit rates 5,000, zero drop frames in OBS. So either Twitch issue, server issue, might be a server issue where you all are getting your, your ping from maybe. Hi Scanlon, how are you doing? Do you still have a Godfather slot machine? Uh, Best to ask Kevin Glass Joe, he would know. Oh yeah, we did not play Huff and Puff 3 because it costs way more. 1 and 2 were our bread and butter. I think I won on 1. I think Rube won on both. 1 and 2. Sleepy, long week. I hear ya, DJ Killboy. I hear ya. Well, I hope you can get some good rest. 
I'm doing all right, Scanlon. Oh, nice. The Walking Dead series is really good. The Telltale games are great. Oh, yeah. They're very volatile. Look at Were Badger using all the terms, too. Were Badger's a gambler, I see. Oh, that's funny. Oh, gotcha, Colossus. I turned off low latency. It's been okay so far. Gotcha. Yeah, because I, I see zero drops, bit rates perfect, connectivity excellent. So literally nothing on my end. At least nothing I can change, so. In an insulated warehouse filled with stainless steel tanks, stream buffering is the last of my worries. I would say so, coffee. Okay, sorry guys. Well, DJ Keltboy, Robco, I don't know who else is on the East Coast, but at least I should say the East. So maybe it's something like that. I don't think it's just you though, Grobco. Here, we can do a, a test here in a second, Marilith, because I gotta... Okay, if you hear me, let's go with the word turkey. Turkey, type it as fast as you can. Although, I just said it again. Okay. Short-ish delay. Let's try it again. Uh, pause and unpause or refresh the stream. I'm gonna try it one more time just to see what the delay is. Thanks for helping me troubleshoot, guys. But yeah, I don't see any connectivity issue on my side, so it might just be Twitch's bullshit. All right, type it as fast as you can. Um, as soon as you hear it, pepper, pepper, P-E-P-P-E-R. <laughs> okay, that was quick on self's part. Rob goes slightly after that. Okay, that's, that's fine. That's usual, two to five seconds is normal, honestly. Okay. I was checking to see what the latency was, so that's okay. So it might be Northeast servers then is my guess. But um, yeah. Marilith, welcome in. Hello, Don Automaton. How are you doing? I was going to say, is anybody overseas getting a delay? That would kind of help narrow it down, but great story writing indeed, Scanlon. I agree. Hi, Michael with two L's. How are you doing? I'm also EST, I got some buffering, but I always assume it's local first, yeah. I appreciate you all letting me know though. Again, I don't see some of that. Like, sometimes I'll see it if my stuff says anything, but like I said, OBS has zero drop frames, the connection says excellent, not stable or unstable, and then the bit rate's at 5,000. So like, all of my stuff is, is proper, so. Hi Crick, how are you doing? Good to see you. Thank you for confirming though, I appreciate it you all. Thank you, thank you. All right, we'll hop into the game here in just a second. I do need to do the Wikipedia page. Hi, Monkey Fluence. Sorry, I didn't mean to pull anybody out of lurks if you're wanting to lurk. Yeah, and I mean, mobile tends to have like a 10 second delay. Every time I watch a stream on mobile, it's 10 to 15 seconds, so. Sometimes a minute delay, Jesus. I'm an Aussie, good here. Gotcha, thank you, Coffee, I appreciate it. Philly sucks as per usual. <laughs> Who would be overseas? Well, that's why I was curious because I noticed DJ Kiltboy and Robco both had it, and I both I know both of them are are northeast, so that's why I was like, hang on. Which again, I don't, might not be the thing, but still, because sometimes it's the server I connect to, which is usually based in Dallas, I think. So I got you, Nana Tomatom. Will you get to sleep whenever you want, my friends? Poseidon. <laughs> I'm glad you're doing well, Cricketoons. Good to see you. Every time I catch a Cricketoon, I think about you. <laughs> I don't know if that sounds weird or bad or creepy or whatever, but I play a lot of Pokemon Go these days, or at least I have been. Well, that's good, Scanlon. Enjoy the dinner, Cri uh, I almost said Crick. Uh, TJ Kelpoy, enjoy the dinner. I hope it's super tasty. Yeah, it just cracks me up because I, I saw one today and I was like, ah, oh, Cricketoon. And they have such pretty sounds. All right, um, let me do this Wikipedia page real fast, and then we'll get into Tomb Raider. The funny thing is, I know like nothing about. This sounds interesting. Well, all right. Um, but yes, I remember nothing from the Tomb Raider game from like two, three weeks ago. So this should be really funny because uh, I'll have to. I'm gonna replay. 
play the obstacle course. I remember the controls work. Yeah, and we're on modern controls. What's up, Veliki? How are you doing? We're gonna struggle through the tombs and we're doing it on modern controls. I'm probably gonna replay the, the mansion little part so I remember what to do because I think I can. I know, I'm sorry, Barileth. I'm sorry. Too many questions, I don't keep up with everything. I, I'm also bad about that as a viewer whenever I'm talking to a streamer who's also doing something similar and then I'm like, I should know better because I should refer back to my message when I'm giving an answer because I, I, I do it to other streamers too. I can't even remember what Poseidon was related to, to be honest with you. Goofy ass lion faces, yes! I'm 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 actually really excited to play more Tomb Raider. Uh, ever since we we did the the raid train thing, I've been excited about it. All right, real quick, uh, Wikipedia page, and then we'll pop back in the game. Uh, PR two classification. Um, PR two previously TA is a Paralympic rowing classification for people with trunk and arm function. The class includes people with spinal cord injuries, including people who have lesions uh, from T10 to L4. This class has its origins in the P2 class, part of the original classification system for the sport developed in 1991. This class is for people with trunk and arm function. Rowing Australia defines the classification as this class. Okay, that kind of reads the same thing. Um, it's a very, very specific thing. It also goes into uh, spinal cord injury and F6 injuries after that. Very interesting. But uh, if you want to read more about that or go down a Wikipedia rabbit hole, there's a link for you. Um, oh, real quick, I need to turn on first. Where is the first command on? I don't even know. Let me look. It is cool. It's like I don't remember. Hello, Electric Man. How are you doing? Good to see you. Herbie, I will ban you. <laughs> no, I won't ban you. I'm using modern controls because I like the modern controls. What was so funny is when Rare was yelling about modern controls to me and Curly, and then me and Curly are like, it's fine on modern controls. And then Rare switched to modern controls too. So I, I won't, I will give her shit to the day I die for that one too. Cause she was like <laughs> yelling at us about the modern controls. And then she ended up switching, so, ha. Yeah, yeah. No, it's fine, Veliki. Like most of the time, well, I say most of the time. It's like a 50-50 if I remember what we were talking about at a given time when it comes to like conversations, if we're bouncing around between conversations, but I do my best to try to remember. Good afternoon or good evening, Careless. How are you doing today? It's good to see you. I, I love giving rare shit. It's great. It's become a new favorite pastime. Curly's mind melting with tank controls was entertaining too. Yeah, that's because uh, Curly also started with tank controls and then switched. I'm over here like, I don't give a fuck. I'm not a purist. <laughs> I'm going straight to playing. Ugh, dude, is there another bot trying to message me? Hey, God. Good Lord. We've not had bots in our community in like a long time. There was one sketchy thing that we got rid of, but uh, one second, real quick. I know I keep saying like, oh, I'm going to get in here, but let me go yell at mods in a different thing real fast. I don't mean yell at them. I just mean hi again. Hi, it's me again. Smile. A bot just joins. <laughs> oh, Lord have mercy. The amount of bot notifications I get on a daily basis is like almost comical at this point. Ba doop, ba doop, one second. All right, there we go. I've done my duty. Oh, I could just turn off direct messages, but it's kind of nice to let them know that they're a bot. So I'll keep accepting message requests from that community so I can let them know to be safe. All right, hang on. Zoop. 
All right. But yes, Curly's mind melting for the tank controls was the funniest thing to me. And then she switched. She's like, oh my God, this is so much better. I'm like, right? But no, play how you want to play. Once again, I will never tell you how to play a game because guess what? Gatekeeping is fucking stupid. And anybody that tries to do it, I'm sorry. Fine. Yeah, you know what? Just don't do it. Good. A best practice. Don't do it. I like how my server level went up because I've notified them so many times of freaking bots. <laughs> That's funny. My uh, my level went up in a community because of how many times I've had to tell them about bots messaging me. <laughs> That's incredible. <laughs> Talking shit in Rare's fourth favorite love language. I'm like 60% sure. Yeah, I adore Rare. She's wonderful. You can tell her I said that. It may give her a big head, but at the end of the day, we all want, you know, to feel like we are appreciated by others. And sometimes we don't always show that appreciation as much. I like to play vintage games in their original language subtitles for the immersion. <laughs> yes, okay. <laughs> Hi, Falcon Freya. I'm doing pretty well today. How are you doing? What's up, Brecket? What a base David to enter chat to. Gatekeeping of almost anything is the dumbest fucking thing in the world. I usually don't call people idiots, stupid, and stuff like that, but that is literally the dumbest thing. So, that's how I'm feeling today. Play the goddamn game the way you want to, as long as you are not breaking laws during so. We'll go that direction. I'm genuinely looking forward to Panda Express when I get back to the States. That shouldn't count, by the way. That's what Rube said, but it's funny. Uh, we will get you Panda Express when you get back into the States. God. <laughs> That's BS. You can't use it. That's not how that works. <laughs> That's fair, self. That's fair. But yes, I appreciate Rare, and I'm glad that we've become friends. I'm glad to call her a friend. Mr. Meepsy, thank you so much for the two-month resub. I appreciate it. How are you doing today? Also, ra one last random thing. Thank you all so much for contributing towards the, the plus program thing. Yes. Because we're at 131 this month already and i think it kind of jumps in the first week and then it jumps around the 20th and so again we'll be uh we'll be doing <laughs> i have to buy a vr headset i'm already trying to save money towards that um because it looks like it's gonna happen but uh, we have to play half-life alex in vr on stream if uh, we hit it all three months which we are uh, well on track to hit it this month and also don't forget to vote in the poll if you voted before this is this is the level two poll this is the second and final vote so don't forget to vote because there's been less votes on this than there was the first one and the first one involved like actually going to researching games this is just a choose one kind of concept so please make sure you do it so a red bull and a trebuchet wait then why do you wait i was gonna say why do you need to give them the red bull because that's giving them wings not making them faster necessarily the trebuchet though works thank you for shading out rare i do love rare she's wonderful she's a good bean hi rad how are you doing also we're gonna be on rad's tournament of streamers this saturday so come cheer me on uh while i play fall guys fortnite and crab game I haven't played Fortnite in eons. I haven't played Fall Guys in eons and I've never played Crab Game. It's gonna be wonderful. I'm probably gonna be out in the first round, but it's gonna be fun to do it regardless. Oh wait, I can start in Lara. Wait, why is this not working? Because I need to click in the game. Wait, what, what? Oh. Wait, oh, I was like, what did I do? I'm gonna go to Lara's home real fast because I want to remember the controls real quick. Also, the level that I'm on, I know I was stuck at the time, so... 
You call Rare a friend? Would a friend let their pals suffer her mistreatment? Well, I'm the good friend that went and Tomorrow, fed her pals multiple times tour. to keep them alive. Use the D-pad to go into the music room. You lied to me last time, Lara. I'm not listening to you. Because I got to remember how to play the game. <laughs> so. Trebuchet increases speed. But that's the thing. Merilith only said the speed. The Red Bull is a red herring. Fair. It speeds their heart rate up. Does that count? <laughs> But yes, we're going to be on Rad's Tournament of Streamers. I've already posted about it in okay. the Discord. I've already Let's posted about tumbling. it. Press the jump button. I am jumping. Okay. It, is that it? You said some tumbling. Just pressing the jump button doesn't feel like tumbling. This is tumbling. We figured out the walk button last time. I got to remember the controls. The reactions to the game selections have been so funny. I bet. Like, I used to play Fortnite a lot, Rad. Like, before there were even seasons. Basically, the second month that Fortnite ever came out is when I started playing. And I played for, like, a year and a half nonstop. Like, I have a shit ton of wins during that time. I haven't played it since then, except for one sponsored two-hour segment. <laughs> so, <laughs> this is going to be great. And I'm not playing them ahead of time because I want stupid shit to happen so i don't want to know about the metas or anything i want to create that sweet sweet ridiculous me don't know what i'm doing content like i am right now uh and then uh crab oh, game i've never ball. played sorry about the crates i'm having some things put oh, into storage good. and the what? delivery people haven't been yet wait is it you better not be on like weird wait is it on weird controls i'm so confused hold up Unless it's just like a fixed camera angle in this area. Yeah, you are on modern controls. It just, for some reason it wasn't, I don't know if that was just like locked, but it wasn't letting me turn the camera. I was so confused for a second. Crab game. I've never played crab game. Literally never Not even like crate, added it to my library. Forward, so, and I'll vault up on dimples! It. I don't have really cute dimples, unfortunately. So it doesn't really work. And then we're also playing, uh, dig, I missed that last message. It went up too fast. Um, and then we're also playing, um, Fall Guys, which a lot of you know, I have played a stupid amount of Fall Guys, but yet again, I haven't played it since I don't know when. Welcome in, Dimples. Welcome in, Raiders. How are you doing? There's an update to Fall Guys. I haven't played Fall Guys since January 28th of 2023. So almost two years. So yeah, like it's not gonna go well for me, but it'll be fun doing it. <laughs> and let's make sure we get a shout out for Rad as well when we get a chance. Uh, I'm sorry, I scrolled up for a second. Welcome, Ed Raiders. Which one is this now? Number two. This is we're playing one dig, but I have to go back and double check the controls because I don't remember how to play. I've never played any of the Tomb Raiders, like the main series Tomb Raiders at all. You've played maybe five rounds ever. <laughs> they just did a new season, so everything just changed to beautiful. Then I won't be so bad. Oh, that's cute, Nez. I love that. Dimples, thank you so much for choosing me to raid. Sorry, everybody. I was trying to catch up with chat. Welcome in. My name is CD. I'm a variety game streamer from Arkansas in the US. We typically focus on first blind playthroughs of story-based games. I need to update that list slightly because we just finished Lies of P. But these are what you can expect to see coming up in the next few months. Keep in mind, it's not an all-inclusive list. I actually have a lot to announce to you all very soon. Um, I have collaborations on collaborations on collaborations um, of all really fun things. Not to mention some other interesting stuff coming up the pipeline that I would like to share with you all. But yeah, some of that has to wait, so I'm not going to tell you about it today. However, I am on Rad's Twi uh, Tournament of Streamers, so please check that out this weekend. 30 of us are going head, 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 head. Anyway, Dimples, how was your stream? How was Yakuza? And welcome in my Gucci Avocado. I like your name. It's fantastic. Uh, Sir, Sir Kimalicious. Hello, Sir Kimalicious. How are you doing? Dimples, of course. How are you? It's good to see you. Please let me know how your stream was. Tell us all the things. If you want to tell us more about yourself, your community, and what you like to play, I also welcome that as well. Today, we're playing some Tomb Raider 1. I have barely played this game. We played about four hours the first day that I played it. But I don't remember how this any of the buttons the work, room. so I I'm going to double check the, the buttons. Button if you want to look around, Press and hold the look button. Then if a jump is too jump. far for me, 
I can grab the ledge and save myself from a nasty fall. If I do a running jump, I can walk to the edge with the white line yeah. until I stop. Oh, wait. Then let go of walk and tap backwards to give me a run up. Oh, wait. Press forward and almost immediately press and hold the jump button. D I won't actually jump. I was jump pretty sure X was. Minute. Yeah, it is. That's weird. I guess because she was already in that. Can I do is it like this? No. Okay. Okay, see that was something I couldn't understand before was like this jump thing because I wasn't actually paying attention to her and the modern controls are slightly different, so it is weird. Thank you for getting a shout out for Red Does Games. I'm very much looking forward to uh that event. It'll be a lot of fun. Okay, well, I did it once, and now I can't do it again. <laughs> this is this is the bad thing about the modern controls because of the way the jumping works. I don't know why you keep going to the sides, but we're going to figure it out. It's fine. If I missed any chat, by the way, please repost it. I feel like I missed some stuff, so my apologies. I was trying to keep up with it. There we go, and there's the grab. So I remember how to do that. We're fine. Stream is good. Have a lot of fun playing Yakuza. It's your first playthrough. Have you played many in the series? Because that was right, what the second really one, right? One. So do a running jump exactly as before, except while I'm in the air, press and hold the action button to make me grab the ledge. I remember we had a problem with this because nice. we couldn't figure out what the action button was on modern controls last time. So try to vault up here. I can't climb up because the gap is too small. I'm aware, so Lara. Right. And I'll shimmy sideways until there is room. Then press forward. Oh, good lord, Ness. <laughs> Tap backwards, and I'll jump off backwards. Immediately press and hold the action button, and I'll grab the ledge on the way down. I don't actually know how to go backwards. We figured that out at one point. No, 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 no. How do I do... How do I go backwards? Because that was something that I needed to, like, figure out. That's not going backwards, though. I don't know how to go backwards on modern controls. That's... I don't remember. I need to figure that out real fast. You can't go backwards with modern controls. Like, at all. I thought I did it last time. I swear I did. Okay, I'm trying to remember how I did the grab of the ledges then. Anywho, I'll figure it out. Hi, Misty. How are you doing? Speaking of Misty, you guys get to find out some, some information that uh, Misty and I will be doing something together in the future. But that's all you guys get for now. <laughs> Hi, Misty. How are you doing? I don't remember how I did it because I 100% know I did because um, of like falling off. I don't know if I have to like fall off and then do that. You have to play through the whole series? Dimples, that's a lot of games. Are you also going to play through like uh, the side game Judgment or just the main series? Oh, I forgot. Uh, let me look at something real quick. I just want to see this. See, this isn't even right, though, because it says action is Y, so I know this isn't even going to be right. Duck dash secondary. Okay, I guess I just did that before. Okay, it's a little awkward, but we'll make it work. Let's go for a swim. The jump button and the directions... Wee. Move me around underwater. Great, I'm doing it. <sighs> oh, air. Just no, definitely not finishing right. all three games no, I today. Take off these wet clothes. These, these, these are not short games. All right, cool. Um, so I was here, and if you guys remember from last stream, is uh that I was confused on where to go, which. Uh, I haven't said it this 
today. But this is a first blind playthrough. Please do not offer hints, tips, tricks, advice, or otherwise unless asked. I use the keyword pineapple. Uh, it is pinned at the top that says that it is what we're going to be doing. Please do not offer unsolicited advice. Um, if I need help, I'll use the keyword pineapple. I know I just said that twice, but I started reading chat and got confused. So... Yeah, no, I will not be doing all three games in one stream. Heck no. Probably not the side games, just the main games for this or through the story, though. That's cool, Dimples. Well, I hope you enjoy them. I've actually not played any of those, but I have played... Uh, I've played a bit of Judgment, and I had a fun time with it. So people said I would like the Yakuza games. I just have never gone around to them. Okay, so... Um, yeah. Coming back to where we were last time. Well, we took off our wet clothes, Careless. We're good now. We got a different outfit. I opened that and was thinking that that was the correct way to go. What the fuck? Where? I thought I killed everything here. Um, but there's this key thing and I never found a key. Oh, I forgot how to interact with these. Oh God, how do I interact? Oh, okay, that's how I interact. Um, and so I never found a key. So I guess I need to go back and look around this area because I clearly missed something, so. Um, yeah, what the hell? Why, why are there more monkeys? I was pretty sure I killed all of you already. Eh. Oh, I'm awesome. All right, I, I will start up here and then I'll work my way down because I don't know what I'm missing. So I'll just run around again because I probably missed something. Hi, Daddy Wisdom. How are you doing? Yeah, on modern controls, I'll see. I already pulled this. What did this do? Oh, that opened and closed that door, which didn't end up being anything particularly helpful. So, okay. Uh, I th there was like healing or something. And I'm like, what is this? So I need to do some exploring and figure out I'm looking for a key somewhere. No, nope. go up, Lara. Go up. Oh, nice electric man. What do you think? Is that something right there? There's a bed kit right there. What the hell? How did I... Lara. <laughs> How did I miss this? I apparently missed this at one point. It is a battle arena, but... How did I miss this? Did I not come in here before or something? <laughs> they got a new shipment of gorillas. <laughs> but I did. I killed lions. I killed gorillas. I killed so much. Can I push it further? Yeah. Can I push it this way? Th this is just... This is just like a dead end or something. Can I pull it? Is that possible? Oh, I can pull it. I knew it. I was like, there's not just a dead end room. <gasps> the key! No shit! Okay, sorry. That was really loud. But like... I just never went in there before then. I'm not joking. Like at the end of last stream, I was looking around for a while, but I never went into this wa That's wild. This, I just happened to go this way first. I had no idea. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm so happy. Sorry. I, I'm blowing my mind over here. I thought I was going to be stuck on this for a while or have to pineapple or something. Cause, <laughs> oh man. Okay. Anyway. Beth. Hi, AVC. How are you doing? It's good to see you. The gorillas are what's in the crate in Lara's mansion. So true. Oh, my God. Yeah. Pull rock. We did it. Hi, Rob, King of Plants. How are you doing? We won the game. That's it, everybody. Pack it up. We're done here. We won. We moved a rock. That's so crazy, though. I guess I just never, like, because I obviously pulled the switch because that door was already open. I just never went in the water. I don't know why. 
took you 20 years to find that. I just got lucky. I'm not even joking, Nez. Like, I just was like, I'm just going to look around each corner and see if I missed anything. That's just wild to me. No, I didn't mean to fall down. I haven't saved. Kill the monkey. Kill the monkeys. Please do not die. Oh, that's how I backed up. You just have to be shooting to back up. I was like, I know I backed up, but uh, we been we backing up this way. <laughs> now I see. That's how you. That's how I back up anyway. I guess. Come here, you. Just did I kill monkey? Okay, I think I killed monkey. All right. Oh yeah, I forgot about the old. Let me do that. Okay. I have to not do the stupid thing. I guarantee you I will at some point today. Guarantee it. But I'm gonna try not to. <laughs> okay, I got. I think it's this way to get back up. I th wait. No. Yes. 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 And then we go this way. Yes. I think. Yes, because then we climb. That's got a lot of fresh blood on it. Did the did the gorillas get down here? We'll see. I'm glad you're doing alright, VC. I'm doing pretty well, thank you. It's a good level design to first show you and then go and find it. That's fair, yeah. I cannot believe <laughs> I can't believe how lucky I just got with that though. Cause I seriously thought I was gonna be looking for a while. <laughs> Apparently the delivery company eventually delivered the gorillas I'm gonna be saving so much until I remember how to like do this properly <laughs> okay no, 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 I did, I did, no. ahem those were words alright look at me go colon elephant strikes again <laughs> elephant strikes again <laughs> Where Badger, thank you so much for the 19 month resub on your Where Badger on the phone account. Good lord, Where Badger supports the hell out of me on all the different accounts. Where Badger, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Enjoy your emotes and ad free viewing on mobile. Monkey see, monkey die. Damn, dig. I mean, you're not wrong, but. All right, I did a thing. Don't forget to grab the Triforce of Zelda. We'll hook up with you. Damn it, where's the Triforce at? That'd be a great Easter egg. Um, okay. Oh, that's a gator. Nope, 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 nope. Leave me be. Gator. Okay, everything's blocked off so far. Uh, uh oh. I think I missed something, chat. <laughs> um, oh, no, please! <laughs> Wait, <laughs> where am I supposed to go? There's gotta be a lever or a switch or something. Oh, fuck. Oh, wait. This? This. Eh. Aha! I completely did not see that. Also, I'm in pain. Um, this button. I have three large and seven small. <sighs> ah. Gator no! <laughs> I'm assuming it's just... Yeah, I was like, I'm guessing it's that one. If all of them weren't down, so we're good. Man, I feel like I haven't talked to you all in a little... That was the end of the level? Oh my god, we were so close to that last time and I just couldn't figure out what was going on. I was so hung up by the door that I thought that was the right way to progress. Well, cool. We finally finished Coliseum. <laughs> that only took me, you know, forever, but that's okay. Oh, really? This level is considered like an S tier level for, for Tomb Raider fans? That's cool. Well, I'll see if I can destroy it. <laughs> I was like, I'll see if I can shit. Nah, I wouldn't do that. 
We'll find out. I cannot get up there. Whoa, that's a gator, that's a gator, that's a gator! Get away! Oh my god, why?! Yes, going in water where with a gator is probably a terrible fucking idea, but game design. It's fine. It's totally fine. Have a good night, Carolus. Thanks for being here. Oh, fuck. Damn it. I was clever. No! <laughs> Damn it, I'm trying to be clever. I don't know if that's actually- I'm assuming that's shooting it. Haha! -ha! See? Clever! Didn't even take a bite out of me. It will destroy you. It will be fun. Oh god. <laughs> okay, Veliki. <laughs> what? No confidence in me. Damn. I mean, that fair, but... Fair, but still. I think jumping makes you slightly faster in this. I've watched Jill do a lot of speed runs. Not that I remember anything about the levels, but I, she jumps a lot, so I think... Okay, that's up somewhere. Wait a second, is this the level with the bullshit three things you have to find? You guys can answer that. Is this the level where I have to find three whatever thing? Um... There was like three, I think it's three. Is that this level? Pineapple, you can answer that question. I'm just curious. <laughs> Whoa, monkey get away. Nope, Laura, you were supposed to jump backwards. Go backwards, Laura. There we go. This is Tomb Raider, you have to be more specific. Okay, coffee, that's a very fair statement. Ads are coming, I'm so sorry. I see ads are coming, just as a heads up. Uh, there was, I have watched a little bit of this game. Normally I never even watch games that I'm gonna play, but I, I have seen bits and pieces of this game over the years. And I remember very specifically Tay and Vadim we're both playing a level where they had to find something like three silver objects or something and they were in like the most ridiculous of fucking places that like you would not have even found easily i think that's the that, maybe i'm wrong but if y'all are like telling me this is a you know s tier level and you're ready for my pain i'm expecting it to be this level so, oh wait a second, hang on. Oh shit, that's how I do it. Okay, good. Well, I got that figured out at least. Okay, well we'll find out. Find three cogs in the first chapter. That's true, Herbie, but like it's, I don't know, it's something a very, it's something very specific. Rob King of Plants over there sipping some tea too, but like, Okay, fair enough. Anyway. Oh my god. Well, we'll see. Dimples, what the heck? Oh, Dimples, I forgot to ask. My apologies. I guess I'm kind of all over the place. It's been three days since the last time I streamed, so my brain is everywhere. Um, but when's the next time you're gonna be live? I, I forgot to ask that so people know when to uh, when to catch you. And I think we got, I know we got the main shout outs and stuff for Dimples, but let's make sure we get another shout out for Dimples. But thank you so much for your prime sub as well. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Thank you very much for the prime gaming sub. And choosing me to use them. At least you get really cool emotes. Speaking of which, I will be adding two more animated emotes soon. Mama is working on one right now. And then he also, I have the hypers emote already. Um, but it's unfortunately like a stupid high bit tier one. Uh, cause I just wanted to be able to use it. <laughs> but, um, I, I plan on putting it somewhere so that people can use it or at least an animated version of it. 
which I realize that in ads, people are not going to be able to hear me saying this, but whoopsies. Video games do love their threes, except for Valve. But Valve hates us, so. <gasps> no, no, damn it. I had a little too much forward momentum. It'll be fine. Tomorrow at 1 p.m. EST, more Dragon of Dimpima. <laughs> Sounds good. Everybody, please go check out Dimples. Uh, do I have a mod that's available that could give another shout out for Dimples? If not, I'll grab it here in just a second. Wee. 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 You know what? Just gonna make it easier on myself. Do not. Okay. I'm gonna be very smart about that and hopefully not oversave. Okay, something. That is a lot of switches. What the fuck? Okay. Hang on. I see this right here. And I think I can. Nope, I can't reach that. Just kidding. Okay. There's also an item up there. There's a whole bunch of little doors. I don't know if I have to do them in a specific order. Why did the music just kick on? Did that do anything for me? Okay, that's open over there, I think, now. Yes. What if I do another one? The music's pretty. Did that close that one? It did. It closed that one and I don't see another one open. So one, two, three, four, but I don't see a fifth one. Where's the fifth one at? I, I don't know where the fifth one is. Let's just see what happens when I do all these. Your PC crashed. Thank you for getting another shout out for uh, Dimples. Also, Juicy, hi. I feel like I might have missed one of your messages earlier. Is that the first time you said anything today? Hi, Juicy. Secret, secret, I got a secret. I'm glad you have a secret. This makes mostly no sense. I just wanted to get that into the suns. <laughs> Fair, Rob. I just went up and read the suns back again. Oh no, you're fine. You guys don't have to be here all the time. Don't have to. Oh my god, fuck off of that. I think you're my first turkey. I don't think we've had anybody else re like do their resub thing. I think you're my first turkey. No, you don't have to. I could have. I could have shouted them out myself. But thank you for getting another shout out for Dimples. And thank you again for choosing me to raid today. Sorry that my brain's all over the place. Juicy! Thank you for the tier 3 sub. I'm pretty sure you're my first turkey. Because I don't think I've had other uh, other tier 3s do their thing yet. So, But thank you for supporting me. I know how long your name is, but it doesn't matter. I was trying to make it look so pretty. You know what? No, this works. This works. I'm doing it my way. I'm doing it my way. Because I call you Juicy anyway. I always forget how long your darn name is, but you're a turkey. Also, I had an idea of where I was going to put these, and then it didn't pan out, so I need to figure something else out. But you're a turkey. Thank you. For the month of December, I'm celebrating every single sub, which, again, I celebrate every single sub, but for anybody that doesn't know, we've been trying to hit the um, plus program thing. And so I've been giving a little extra incentive for the tier three since they're they're worth six points. But uh, for the month of December, I'll be putting everybody on ornaments. So I, I want to celebrate everybody. So I apologize if it seems a little lackluster on the other instances, but I appreciate you all very, 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 very much. 
And again, since I switched to full-time content creation, this is how I get paid now. So it, uh, it goes a long way. Uh, it goes a long, long way. So thank you. Um, I got a feeling you can only have one of these open at once is my guess. So that is my guess. I'm assuming just pulling them all is not going to work, but let's just, I'm just, I'm just checking things here first. Juicy, oh, I also didn't do maracas. Maracas, thank you so much again, Juicy, for supporting me. I appreciate you so much. So freaking much. Also, <laughs> I was going to say, I'll accept that if it's being dumb. How dare you tell the roll tie to fuck off? I know, I'm like, thanks for the sub, also fuck off. <laughs> but I'm a terrible person. Okay, I'm going to re-bring these up real quick because I want to see what happens. Hi, Duo. How are you doing today? Good to see you. What have you been up to? Uh, I'm going to be real honest with you. My sleep schedule has been all kinds of fuckery. And I have not caught, like, almost anybody's streams recently unless they stream at degenerate hours. Okay, I don't see the fifth door. If there even technically is a fifth door. Or maybe I have to do one and then go to that place. Because nothing else seems to be opening. So I must need a combination. Like once I go in that first door, there's going to be something there. Okay. Juicy, you know how I feel about Bama. Get that shit out of here. Okay, there. That'll open that door. Door is open. Okay. And then let's see what's down here. Oh, so I don't have to make the jump puzzle every time. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Okay. Well, I don't have to make the jump puzzle ever again, so that's nice. Um, Because there was the door here, door here. Is another door on the other side of this? No. There's just no fifth door, so I don't understand the last thingy, but that's okay. All right. That's fine. I'm good. Just chilling. Um, excuse me. Okay, um... Oh, they turned off! I was just gonna go for it! No! I missed the last jump! No, I missed the last jump. No. Damn it, I was like, I got this. Wait, so when, okay, it just like turns off. Oh, it's time, okay. Nope, we gotta wait again. I get it, I get it, I get it. I don't know what's in the water, I didn't see. I'm so upset that I missed the last jump though, fuck. I had that first try. I'm glad that you're doing well though, dude. What are you playing nowadays? Because I know you finished up some stuff, and I actually don't know what you're streaming right now. I was already fearing you'd miss the shortcut. I wasn't that bad, Bellaki. Boom! Hi! How are you? I know. I know, Juicy. That's why I like giving you shit for it. Oh, uh, did I miss it again? Fuck! You need to be on like that last toe bean to get the freaking jump. Oh man. Damn it. Oh nuts. <laughs> oh nuts. Don't know me, Lara. <laughs> God damn it. Lara. Lara. Lara! <laughs> I don't know what's in the water. What the fuck even is that? Are those rats? Very big rats. It's a pinky Joe tum tump. Pinky toad jump dump. <laughs> Go. All right, I got this. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Final. All right, we totally have that. Okay, get up, Laura. Get up, get up, get up. God damn it! No, Laura, grab the item. Grab the item, Laura. No, we're dead. <laughs> damn it! No. <laughs> Boom, the premature GG. <laughs> but 
<laughs> I was gonna jump in the water, but I wanted the item first. <laughs> that was funny. I wanted the item first. I got this. I got this. Oh, we totally have this this time. Get up! Up! Good, good, good. Girly, go! Woo! Alright. Now act like I did that the first try and it's fine. I got a brick. <laughs> At least that's what it looks like. I got a brick. That's why there's saves in the game, boom, though. Because then I can just reload. <laughs> and then it's no problem. Third strike. <laughs> Love it. Okay, well, we got the shortcut for the jumping puzzle. We got whatever the fuck this is. Um, hang on. Oh, it won't let. Oh, because I'm not in a thing. Wait, then how do I know what's in there? I don't know what I picked up. It just looked like a brick. Oh, lead bar! This is the level I was thinking of. This is totally it. Oh, you guys want to see me suffer because I know I remember watching Tay and Badam and like three other people. I feel like this is the level that I've always seen. Again, I didn't really like pay close attention or like watch watch, but I just remember everybody yelling about this level. The lead bar thing. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Follows are anonymous. Feel free to lurk or chit chat, whatever you're vibing with. <sighs> Easier due to the remaster. Uh, TL, uh, TR1 Laura not having to count steps is an OG. She did a delayed jump in the OG. Oh man, I believe it, Veliki. Well, modern controls felt really good there. So, also speaking of which, I think I can make that. I hear gorillas again. Why? But I hear them. Hi, Arcane! Ah, oh, shit! Whoa, no, girls! Shoot, Garita! Why, Garita? Why are you here? Yeah, go away, bish. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try for this. Aw, uh, didn't hit. I think there's gotta be something up there. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try again. Let me kill this Garita while I'm at it. Cool. <laughs> All right, we're good. Uh, Arcane, good to see you. Hello. Cozy Tomb rating is going well so far. Thank you. At least I, I made it past the level that I was like stuck on last time, which was funny. I just got very lucky. I learned something just now. The thing. Wait, you learned something. <laughs> good. Educational stream. Oh, did it? Yeah, you can switch between the graphics. I think it's really cool. I love that remasters do that. Because it's very, very cool to see. All right, I'm saving one more. I, I I, think I can make this. I feel like there's going to be something hidden up there. I don't know if it be anything good, but... It doesn't like that angle, so I don't actually know if I can make that or not. But I'm going to keep trying. Tomb Raider's your favorite? Welcome in, Dragonfire. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Happy to have you. I know a lot of people like their Tomb Raider. I'm going to try for a few more attempts. Like I said, I don't know if anything's up there, but we're going to try. Wow. Yes, I got the angle. Let's go. There's nothing up here. Damn it. Like, I thought that was so clever. I was so proud that I was like, oh, I can get someplace that maybe the game doesn't want me to be. Anyway. I stole their lead bars. The gorillas are coming. <laughs> uh, Combat Bravo, welcome in. And thank you for the bits. I appreciate it. Thank you for the wow bits. Viking, good to see you. How are you doing today? Was it Tomb Raider 1 was your all-time favorite Dragonfire? Do you have a favorite? 
Finnick, good to see you. Hello. How are you today? I like the game so far, Dragonfire. We played a little bit a couple weeks ago, and I'm just now getting back to it. Yeah, the fall damage is brutal. All right, so we've already done this, so I don't need this pulled anymore. Now, there might be like a, a specific thing to this, but we'll see. Okay, that didn't open, that didn't open, and that didn't open. Great. Um, I already tried pulling each of them individually. I'm gonna do a little bit of process of elimination here. There's a lot of input, so. Um, is, is that another gorilla? I thought I saw another gorilla for a second. I was scared. So. I might go explore part of the other the other part of the map because I don't know how to activate these. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna leave these alone for a little bit, I guess. Cause I don't know what order I need them in. Maybe I'll find something to help me. Anyway. You could say that about any game though, Herbie. Let's be real. The remaster is very good. Uh, I, Of course they could do more. They could always do more. But more takes time, money, manpower, stuff like that. And saying that you can always do more, guess what? We can do more with everything in our lives. So I, I love the features that they included. The feeling of accomplishment is up there, it does. Oh, Arcane, I just drank Dr. Pepper and you had a redemption for water. Arcane, thank you for the hydration. Hello, it's Dubs. Are the controls any better than the original version? So I am unfortunately not a good person to ask because I never played the original. This is my first time ever playing Tomb Raider. So I don't have a good answer for you there. I can just say that I very easily adapted to the modern controls. However, people who have played with the tank controls in the past probably prefer those. I'm very happy that they gave multiple options, basically. I think it is more approachable for somebody like me who has never played before and struggles with tank controls because I didn't grow up with that. So hopefully that kind of helps your, your answer. And of course, I love that you can switch back and forth, which is what we were just talking about. Man, it go, that's a gorilla. <laughs> I'm ready. Go, go. Yeah, got you. But we good. Dubs, welcome in though. Hope you're doing well. First time playing this one. Loving it so far. Oh, that's nice. Yep, this is my first time playing too. And I never played. <laughs> I have to say it's not technically my first Tomb Raider game. Because I played one on the Game Boy Color called Curse of the Sword, I think. But I didn't ever even beat that. That was when I was a kid, so. I hear another gorilla. Ooh, and the fucking creepy lions! With the weird teeth! They have weird teeth! Laura, I need you to go the direction I'm telling you to go. You know what? That kind of worked. Ooh! <laughs> Kill the lion. I still hear another gorilla somewhere, too. Sometimes seeing items is easier on the OG. Oh, there's bats, too. Why are we still shooting the bat? Shoot the other bats. There's multiple bats, Laura. There's still multiple bats, Laura. I love how you're so after one bat. Jeez. Yeah, me versus all the animals, basically. <laughs> uh. That gorilla is one week from retirement, then it shouldn't have messed with me, should it have? <laughs> Got him. Feel good ink. I actually don't care for their music now. <laughs> I know that's the joke, but <laughs> the gorillas, but I actually don't care for their music. 
grew up with the original. I hate tank controls. If the updated controls feel good, that's a great, uh, great updates. Yeah, no, I, I think they do dubs. Now, of course, again, some people do like the tank controls. I'm just happy the option exists, but I am playing modern and I mean, I'm progressing the game just fine. Uh, I think some of the jumping and stuff are confusing. I will say if anybody does play this with modern controls, that the beginning tutorial is mapped for con tank controls. So it won't make sense. <laughs> so like if you play with a controller and you, uh, you need to learn how to grab ledges, it's actually right trigger. So, uh, cause it keeps telling you to press the action button and the action button is defined as Y or triangle, whatever your control, type of controller you're using. That is incorrect. <laughs> However, the rest of the game has been really good with modern controls. I haven't had like very many issues at all, especially since I learned the whole walk thing, but I'm glad you're having a good time, Ness. I am struggling with, oh, good Lord, Lara. What are you doing? <laughs> struggling with getting onto this though, because it's not a ledge to actually pull me up. You should see, oh yeah, we've seen their teeth in the OG graphics. They're horrifying. Look at that thing. I always talked about it being like the little teeth clackers. It's like somebody is like, oh, here's some dentures and just puts it inside of a lion's mouth. That's what it looks like. <laughs> I'm glad to hear it though, does. I know, I'm sorry, Robco. I, I can be a disappointment sometimes. But yeah, better, oh my God. <laughs> Yeah, I'm having a hard time of figuring out how to land on this properly because I can't get like the run jump thing. So I don't know how to best. Maybe I should jump to there and then use the side. Actually, that's probably what I need to do. They do dubs, they do. So it's fun to see where it came from, where it is now kind of situation, but it's also really nice because the OG actually has it a little bit easier to see items sometimes. So I've actually switched back to the OG multiple times just for like items sake. It's not letting me get up there. Why? I feel like I'm supposed to be able to. Maybe I can like jump back No. It Okay, maybe that is, uh, maybe I'm not supposed, well, it looks like I should be able to get up there because of that little thing right there. Hmm. Okay, hey, I'm gonna try one more time and then if I can't get that, I'll go explore more of the level. Cause I feel like we haven't seen very much of the level yet. Okay, that's a slide one too, so yeah. I don't know if I can, how does this work? Oh, I can't do that against this wall. Okay, never mind. Maybe this comes out here and you come down here later. Maybe that's what it is. All right, I'm gonna go look for at more of the level and remember this bookmark it in my head, so to speak. Yoink. But yes, yeah, so you can switch back and forth between the modern and the old graphics at will, so. Oh, they gave her a more realistic waist, thank god. What is this direction? Oh. Why? Oh. Yeah, nope. Where? Get away, gorilla! I saw another one. Can't hide from me, I saw you. See what we got over here. Like in this case, that's a lot lighter. Obviously, the lighting's dynamic and the remaster looks a little bit better. But light-wise, I can see better this way. These look scary. Oh, there's something there. I never. Oh god. <laughs> Where? Wait, what? Why gorilla? Why more gorilla? <laughs> Ow, what the hell? 
I have shotgun shells, but I don't want to use them on nearly beloved. Oh, that's fair, I guess. Nope. Get away, Garita. I didn't know I'd be shooting so many gorillas when playing this game. I kind of feel bad about it, but... Are you kidding me? How many gorillas? Are they just gonna keep respawning? That'd be terrible. Ugh. Am I even hitting that gorilla? I don't think I was. I think it was still locked, quote unquote, locked onto the other one. I just died. What the hell? There's so many gorillas. Hi, look at all that juice. I'm doing all right. How are you doing? Thank you for the 69 bits. I appreciate you. Uh, I was still here. Okay. Wait, why do I hear another gorilla? You must be upstairs in this area. So many gorillas, good lord. That's fair, Rob King of Plants. And yeah, again, that's why I like having the option. Having the option is nice. <laughs> Demon taste. Away, away with you. More gorilla because less lion? Maybe. I guess we're no more lion because we're not in Liza P. Okay, I know I'm terrible. It's fine. I'd rather be killing the lions than a bunch of dogs. Or gorillas than a bunch of dogs. Because dogs get the tail end of everything. Their vengeance for killing their friends? Well, their friends shouldn't have come after me. Come here. Get, come, get, get, get around the corner. Because then there's going to be like three more that spawn again. Okay, hang on. We're gonna save real quick. Did they give her abs? <laughs> Through her t-shirt, I love it. Love it. Okay, saving there. Just finished works, so relaxing for a bit. Very nice. I'm enjoying it, Juice. I played this on uh, the highlight team highlight raid train uh, a couple weeks ago for Tomb Raider's anniversary. And I was really having fun and wanted to play more of it. So I added it to, to the lineup. Okay. Surely they can't get up here. I said, surely they can't get up here. Good. I love a tiny ledge. Means they Oh, shit. There's two more. Found the cheese strat. One of you should almost be dead, because I already put bullets into one of you. Come here, gorillas. I'm going to finish killing you so you don't scare me whenever I'm looking around. Okay, big doors over here. Okay, I guess I'm going to have to wait for them to come back. Any jumpy area here? Nope. I have no idea what I actually need the lead bars for. I've only found the one. Oh shit, that opened. That scared the crap out of me. I was not expecting that to open. <laughs> also, where'd the gorillas go? I wanted them to come back after I got off the ledge so I could finish the job. I am constantly looking around for like ways to get up places because this game definitely has a lot of exploration, which makes sense, but I feel like I've missed so much. It's like you've missed X amount of secrets. I'm like, shit, it's fine though. Mm hmm. I missed the Xbox 360 Tomb Raider as well. That was my first Tomb Raider experience. Yeah, I've never played those either. Juice. I was thinking about going in. Ah, you son of a bitch! I knew it would happen whenever I would least. Ex How are you?
are you not dead? What the fuck? I had already done so much damage to you! I can't see anything. Okay, that one's dead. That's bullshit. I do love that they gave me a med kit, but I'm still gonna use one of my smaller ones. What jerk? I swear to God. Why? Why are there so many minkies? Where are you? Oh, you were almost dead. Okay, that other one must have been a new one then. Because the other two were definitely almost dead. But yeah, I would like to play the Modern Tomb Raider series at some point on stream. I just don't know when, so. Are you fucking kidding me? Are they- they seriously are just continuously respawning. Okay, that one was almost dead too. Oh my god, okay. Hang on. Before I progress, I have killed so- I'm just ballistically saving right now. There's just so many freaking gorillas. I didn't, Arcane. That sounds cute. I have the Super Nintendo one. I bought that whenever it first came out. Oh, switch. I was like, I don't even know where that is. I haven't been there yet. Okay. Well, let me go see that now. Uh, that's the one about touching and turning to gold, Veliki? I think, correct? But that's really cool, Arcade. I love that. I would totally get that. I wanted the gorillas to show up so I could finish them off, Robco. You're right. We love this section called the zoo. Just a pile of apes. Okay, I was curious because I wonder if I can actually jump up there. I think I can. Uh, no, I don't think I can make that jump, actually. Oh, maybe I can. Maybe. Wait till the last second kind of jump. Oh, looks like I could make that, but I don't think I actually can. No, I don't think it lets you. Or maybe it does and I'm just bad at jumping, but anywho. Well, the only way I haven't gone yet is this way, which must be where that gate with the stuff was. Lions, bats, alligators, gorillas. The whole zoo's here. Hey, yeah, look at- oh, fucking hell. <laughs> of course! And gorillas! Lots and lots of gorillas! So many gorillas. Never mind, this, this, this is not killing endangered species. This is making them an endangered species. Oh my god, I thought there was three. There's so many. Well, did you survive? If it was a bit aggressive, did you at least survive? Sorry, I keep itching my nose. For some reason, my nose keeps getting itchy, so. Oh, that's interesting, Velikia. Yeah, I could always flip back and forth, too. Yeah, the VOD will be up, Herbie, you know, on Twitch after today. And then, of course, it'll be on the actual archive channel. Um, probably in the next day or two. Uh, just a heads up as as something uh, kind of funny in a way. And I don't expect it to go anywhere. But the archive channel actually has enough hours to be monetized. Which is kind of fucking wild to me. Because it's literally just my old VODs. Um, but that kind of cracks me up. Now, it has the amount of hours. It does not have nearly the amount of subscribers. Uh, it takes a thousand subscribers and 4,000 4, hours of watch time. Um, and we only have like 298, which I never really pushed people subscribing to the archive because, you know, like it's an archive. It's not, it's not designed to be like, you know, YouTube content, but, um, yeah. It's 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 just kind of funny that it that it's there, which yeah, I'm hoping 
once I can actually start recording for YouTube, which will be once the dual PC setup, which like, by the way, I got the desk in for that. And I was going to take a couple of days off next week to get everything set up, but something else came into the works that I will be doing Tuesday of next week. There's a lot going on, <laughs> a lot going on right now. <laughs> a lot. I, I can't wait to share with you all, but hi, Redneck. How are you doing? Good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Silverhawk says monkey business, a lot of monkey business. You did survive. That's good, Rube. Good job. But yeah, it, it was funny that the archive actually wow. hit <laughs> hit the uh, number of hours that it needed to be monetized, but it's nowhere near the subscriber count, which makes sense. It's not like designed for that. But hey, if you want to sub to the archive, you know, uh, 700 people away from <laughs> being monetized, but... I, I was never going to push the archive. I need to actually record true YouTube content and put that on the actual channel. Oh, that's the thing. Um, I was really expected to be able to interact with this, but... I um, guess not. Bonk. Bonk. Up, up is Lara. Okay, we'll grab that. I don't remember if I can go under like places like that. Oh, I got more music. I must be on the right track. Midas, hey, we just were at least mentioning that person. Hi, SL. Streaks through chat with Golden Palace stenciled on his back. Wait, what? I don't get the reference. Unless that's also to do with Midas. Anonymous, thank you for the 25 wow bits. I appreciate it. I'm glad you're doing great, Redneck. Working hard, relaxing harder. That's the way to do it, my friend. Very glad to hear that. <laughs> wow, okay, Veliki. Right? That's that's what it's there for. The gorillas know how to tell time, damn it. Don't you know they know how to use basic tools? The music's very good in this game question I, and this is not like a pineapple question or anything did they remaster the music as well i'm assuming so but it like, just sounds good in general oh okay So, um, I'm assuming he turns lead to gold, but, so, there's a Midas statue, oh, become golden Lara, oh, I was, I touched Midas, duh. Oh, that's cool! That's so cool! That's really, really cool! Hey, at least I saved right before I did that. What if I touch his foot? It won't let me touch his foot. That's so cool, though. I love that. Oh, God! Keep it in the regular! <laughs> Ugh, toes. <laughs> See, I would have been able to tell easier in this. I probably would have jumped straight on it though, because that would have like I would have thought I needed to. Well, that's neato. Okay, so yeah, there's like nothing else to do here right now. All I got left is that crazy room with all the stuff on it. Cause, well, there's nothing over here, right? No. That won't let me land on it, which makes sense. Okay, don't know how to open these. Can't interact with the sundial. Can I push them or anything? No. Okay, so no idea what's going on here. Let me go back the other way then. Oh, 
what I do? Oh, whoa. I had not clicked that button at all, and I can free look? That's pretty sick. I didn't even know I could do that. Anyway. Hi, Unobi. How are you doing? That was so cool. I loved that. I think every person died here once. Hey, I got the, uh, I got an achievement for it, so. The remaster of it looked really cool, but it, you could tell it was golden a lot easier. That'd be a horrible way to go. Yes, it would. I guess at least it'd be quick. The feet were horrible. <laughs> Don't sniff the feet, Robco. Ooh, how does going gold look in this version? That's a good question, actually. I wanted to see. That probably looks really neat. Hang on, going back to find out, because I'm curious, too. <laughs> Foot Fiend remaster. I was like, that's the one time I don't want to have the remaster on, is looking at his feet. <laughs> oh, okay, Asal. I didn't know that. Yeah, free look. I didn't even realize free look was a thing until just then. All right, let's see what turning gold looks like now. Oh, wait. Interesting. That looks really good. That was neato. Okay, so yeah, I'm definitely supposed to take the lead bars there. So we've done the two directions. Now I don't know what the gates here do. Maybe that's once we put lead bars on it, but let me go back to the other room then, because that's apparently where I'm supposed to be getting the bars. So. It's somehow satisfying when Lara jumps full tilt with her head into the ceiling. Hi, Steel. How are you doing? Good to see you. And you know I hope you're doing well. Good to see you. Yeah, it looked really cool. Needs more ray tracing. Needs more cowbell. Needs more crowbar. Yeah, the gorillas will be like me if I'm... Okay. Um, golden. Alright, so let me go back here then. Oh, I didn't even realize this was open. Oh, it's not. <laughs> wow, they really changed that. <laughs> They're like, no, we don't want to like make the ceiling look cool. Just, just make it open and throw some trees up there. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh... Yep, I see exactly what to do. Okay. I'm taking pictures of these. I don't care if that sounds like it's cheating, but... Because back in the... There's just a lot of spikes in there. Because back in the day, you would have just wrote it down, so... I'm glad you're doing well, Steel. Things are going alright. Thank you. I appreciate the, the sentiments. Needs more head crab. I don't know about that. I don't know about the head crab thing. Even I don't consider that cheating fair. Like, because if I was a kid, I would have just wrote it down. So. Right, exactly, Veliki. Exactly. You are absolutely allowed to pick at me, and you can even stare at them if you want. I won't even tell you that my eyes are up here. Because, um. You know, it would kind of suck to have that pointy of boobs. It was funny. Where where was where was I yesterday? Oh, it was in hockey's stream. And hockey's like, I'm so tired of boobs. And I agree with that statement. Boobs can be so annoying. Like they're fun, but they're very annoying. But like very pokey boobs. Like Laura with that figure she's got, 
those would give her back problems. And uh, that would suck. But hi, Pikami. How are you doing? How's your DBD been? That's true, Marilith. That is true. Ironic. Look, not ironically. I, I just never use those, but like, I remember that. You keep your eyes away from my girlfriend's polygons. Lara's your girlfriend? Holy shit, I didn't know that. My polygons are up here. <laughs> She's backing rockets. <laughs> uh, yeah, I've gained weight picking me, and now my boobs are being annoying again, and I'm like, God damn it. I want to lose weight again to get rid of my boobs. That is a thing I never thought I would say. But, like... I gained weight again, and now my boobs are bigger, and it means I'm either going to have to change bra size or get rid of this shit again. So. <laughs> I'm saying that, Cell. I am saying that. Okay, let's, uh, let's do these. All right, so we've got this and this. And this. Now, is that open or not? It is, okay. Because it was marked out, so I didn't know if one of them I needed to move. John, how was the rest of your stream? I said it earlier because I adore you and I appreciate you as a friend, but everybody go follow John if you're not already. He's currently playing Cuphead. He also plays a heck and wide variety of all sorts of different indie games and is very, very cozy and fun to hang out with. And he has an adorable cat named Lilith, who I once hoard out on my own stream for like $5 a picture. So. I gotcha, pick of me. I gotcha. It's fun to play again, but. We working out then? I need to work out, yes. We have a new room and a new puzzle. Lilith is so cute. Oh my god, the like having her paws up earlier. Ugh, I melted. Also, when I was driving from getting food earlier, I looked out of the window and there's just this lady with the biggest shit grin on her face and she's petting a cat outdoors. And I think she was the chosen one and the cat came up to her. And I almost like wanted to stop to see if I could also pet the cat. I'm not even joking. <laughs> I just really wanted love from the cat. Cause that lady looked so happy and I'm like, I'm gonna let her keep her happiness. <laughs> Cause it'd be weird if I just like pulled up in my car and I'm like, can I pet the cat too? We could have been friends after that maybe. But at the same time, I was like, she's having a really nice moment with this adorable cat. I should let it be. <sighs> oh, really, Veliki? Great. Lilis is super cute. I did that last year picking me and it didn't end up well for me, so exercise is what I need to do, which I don't have the excuses that I used to that I ha don't have as much time because that was a very valid excuse when I worked two full-time jobs. But, um... Nowadays, I, I need to work out. I do. Cats are wonderful. Fucking what did I just do? That scared the shit out of me is what it did. I feel like I need to move more of these. <laughs> Oh, can I slide it in this corner? Let me see. <laughs> oh. Never mind. I thought I could, like, pull these more, so that's why I did that. Okay. I just wanted to pet a kitty cat. Oh, did I break things? Where the fuck am I? Hang on. What? 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 Did I do that? The old uh, Urkel thing. Did I do that? I'm gonna go with a yes, I did do that and broke it. But on purpose, kind of breaking. 
<laughs> oh, I think I start from the top. I think that's why there's a staircase over here. That makes sense. Oh, that'd be cute. Robco. I am that strong, man. Veliki, I'm so strong. I am just- Oh, God. Okay, which means there has to be a lead bar somewhere. Okay, we gonna save again. What we got here? Okay, we got a ledge here. Oh, what? Oh my god, Lara! Okay, apparently I do need to jump. I was hoping I could literally- <gasps> No! I just saved over that. Damn it, I did it the opposite. Why? <sighs> oh my god, why do I hear gorillas again? Yes, Rube. I fixed it. It's fine. Those are chest muscles. Damn, no wonder she's just strunk. Oh, I've done this. I did this so many times. Uh, Rob King of Plants in the first stream. Like, an insane amount. There we go. It's fine. It's fine. I'm good now. <laughs> that is a pretty far jump. Save. We're good. Look at me. I did it right now. It's fine. It's fine. It is fine. It's fine. See? It's fine. <laughs> Top tier save strats all the time. <laughs> We're good. I did it. I'm being patronized. Thank you, Rube, for the bits. Where am I right now? Where's that? Oh, there's an item down there. There's a lot of gorillas and bats. Did I kill it? No. Yeah, come back over here. I'm not going over there until I kill at least some of these guys. Okay, one gorilla. One bat. No, focus the bat. Focus the bat. Lara! Lara! Focus the bat! I didn't panic. You all panicked. It's fine. Herb, thank you for the bits. I killed the other gorilla. Oh, there's another gorilla down there. Okay, where am I? Ah, uh, okay, now I know where I am. At least from a level perspective. There's an alligator down here. Alligator is dead. Is very, very dead. Okay. Now, I don't think I want to go down here, right? Because I can't, I won't be able to get back up if I go down right there. But I need to remember that there's something, I think those are shotgun shells. 
Probably. Oh, I didn't even see the ads were coming up. Oh, wait, no, they start in three minutes. Okay, just a heads up, ads are in three minutes. I don't want to play tag with them, no. I played tag with them with my gun to their face. That's how I play tag. Oh god, there's another one! Ah! Okay, they played tag with me back. That's unfair. Tag, you're it for your death. Damn it. <laughs> you're it. There's gonna be more, isn't there? Yoink. Hold up. Is there anything? There? Hang on, is there something up here? Yoink. Is, is there anything up there? No. Okay. I'll just make it sure I'm looking. I'm trying to, I'm trying to be observant. I am an observer. Okay. Oh, hold up. There's stuff over there, too. Can I? Hello? Oh, I can't reach that high up? Oh, what? Okay, I apparently can't reach that high up. Oop, missed it. Jumpies. What? How am I not getting that? No. Damn it. I got this. We'll get this. Hello, Damon. How are you doing today? Yoink. Okay, so it's that one I'm trying to avoid, I think. So if I just kind of jump that way, I, I can make that, I think. That'll be fine. Platforming the bane of your existence. I love platformers. <laughs> but you already know that. Oh, wait. Does it not? Wait, I'm confused. I was able to jump on that one last time. Hang on. What? Wasn't I? Am I crazy? Probably. Hello, Caffeine Terry. How are you doing today? <coughs> Does it not let me... Why is it not letting me on this one? I swore I was on this one last time, but maybe not. Okay, maybe not. Okay, so let me jump and jump. There we go. Oh, this is a secret? This isn't even a real thing. This is just a secret. There was a secret? Fuck, where am I supposed to go? I didn't know all this was for a secret. I worked hard to get over there. Well, damn, okay. I should be proud I got a secret, but at the same time, <laughs> I was just trying to progress. Okay, so I do need to drop down there, and that leads to that area. Okay, so that was all just a secret. Okay. okay go me, I guess, but... Whoopsies. Right, worth it? <laughs> Not really. There's literally a medkit and ammo right there too, so like, <laughs> it's fine. I did finish Crash 4. And I even did the Storm Castle in Crash 3. I never 100%ed them, but I loved those games. It was funny because I didn't grow up with PlayStation, so Crash Bandicoot wasn't a game I ever played until... Um... 2019 and then I played them and I love them this is oh whoops this is also a sacred damn there was actually a lot there though and now I need to heal anyway so <laughs> hello monkey great uh, run away, run away, run away. there's probably one behind me too but haha -ha. Got him. 
Okay, we're not leaving this place until I find a lead bar. Oh, there's my kit. I can make that, I think, is the boon of my existence in Tomb Raider. Oh, I have to wait for ads. I'm sorry. Wait, Terry, can you hear me? If not, I will wait a second. The 106% was painful. I remember really enjoying it, Veliki. Now, granted, I played it at launch. Um, so, to be honest with you, like, if you asked me about specific levels and stuff, I would, I would have no idea now. Because I only played it the one time. But I did love it. I really enjoyed it. I thought the masks and stuff were a lot of fun. Yeah. Crash had amazing commercials in the early PSX days. Absolute classics. It's it's funny you mention that, Asel. I saw one of those the other day after I watched a classic GameStop commercial with the GameStop bunny. I don't know if anybody remembers those commercials, but they were hilarious <laughs> and pretty crude considering like GameStop's image. And I, that's probably why I was retired eventually. But the, the GameStop bunny was pretty fucking hilarious. And so I... I don't even know how I came across it. Oh, I was purging my Facebook. And th that was like the most random thing you guys could have came into. Just <laughs> talking about old GameStop ads. Hi, Lollip. How are you doing? Thank you for the raid. Perfect timing, by the way. The ads just finished eight seconds ago, so I was just standing here waiting for the ads to get over. Welcome in, Raiders. How are you doing today? Lullip said we can talk about piss. Hell yeah. Do you need to go take a piss? You can. Like, we're, we're piss friend. Never mind. I'm not going to say that because somebody's going to clip it and then it's going to sound stupid and out of context, but it usually does. So, yeah. Welcome in, Raiders. How are you doing today? My name's CD. I'm a variety game streamer from Arkansas in the U.S. Around these parts, we focus on first blind playthroughs of story-based games. There's a list of what you can find right now and upcoming. So if that interests you, feel free to stick around. I'm a pretty chatty Kathy and I love a lot of different games. So we're playing Tomb Raider 1 for the very first time. I've never played a Tomb Raider before and yes, I suck at it. <laughs> so welcome back from ads. I'm sorry for the ads people, but it, that was good timing on the raid. Coffee Field Gaming, welcome in. Turkey for dinner, welcome in. Lollip, thank you so much for the really large raid. I appreciate you. How are you doing today? Uh, let me see what Lollop was getting up to. Project Zomboid. I was uh, I was hardcore <laughs> in Lollop's channel the other day. I don't know if you're still doing the same run, but she was doing like a a winter like mod run. I I don't re we talked about it a little bit because I didn't know what it was, but apparently it's a mod that makes the entire game like a frozen tundra like land, and is a very cool challenge because like I've been enjoying Project Zomboid for a while. But I haven't done a lot of like the large pop like challenges and stuff, but I also haven't tried something like that. And I thought it was really cool because I hadn't seen somebody do that yet. Everybody, please go check out Lollop. She's really cool. I got to meet her in person at TwitchCon and she was honestly just as cool as I thought she was going to be. Uh, check her out. She's really nice. She obviously sent a lot of love our direction. So if you all wouldn't mind checking her out, she is really cool. And I enjoy spending time and over in her community. She's funny. Uh, oh, my God. Uh, speaking of the, uh, <laughs> Lollip, I have to bring this up. I don't know if we have a clip or if somebody from the raid has a clip, but if you do, please let me know and I'll permit you in the chat so you can post it. But, uh, I almost pissed my pants. Speaking of piss, <laughs> anyway, uh, I almost pissed my pants in Lollip's stream. I think this was about two weeks ago now, if I'm not mistaken. It was two or three weeks ago. It was during the next fest. And Lollip was playing the uh, the crew cabin simulator game or whatever. It's like where you're a flight attendant. And that game was fucking hilariously broken. I was laughing my ass off because of the sound. If anybody has a clip from that, I will 
stop and play it immediately because i i'm not joking i was in tears i was laughing so hard and yeah i actually had to go piss or i was gonna piss myself so yeah if you got one just let me know and i'll uh i will permit you or the mods will permit you because there were so many and i would love to highlight that because i i really enjoy hanging out in lolo's community she's super welcoming awesome friendly she's pretty funny her chat is malicious in <laughs> in like the best ways wholesome wholesome uh wholesomeness let's go with that uh panty lion welcome in hope you're doing well today displace uh salad good to see you I would displace you too. I'm not a big salad eater, <laughs> as my figure definitely entails. Quiet, good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Uh, Taffy Nate, you can definitely talk about it here. Also, thank you for the follow. I do have anonymous follows if people want to chill here. They're more than welcome to. Um, and feel free to follow if you enjoy the channel. So, uh, I'm doing okay. I got gotcha. you. I am doing okay as well. <laughs> Without with we'll just say current events because i don't talk politics on this channel current events have left me uh, a bitter old lady at this point uh, i die a lot i feel like a newbie i mean it's a very hard challenge yeah pick me you would really like lollop she's cool the cryogenic winner yeah that one i don't blame you redneck those i i, I never played san andreas either i welcome myself in so you can't welcome me in me one you two hang on i gotta make sure i say the name right hakaishi hakaisha hakaisha it depends on how i say that but how dare you one me up in my own stream that's fine uh, i'm surprised you didn't get into current beta for 42. i have so much stuff going on right now i i didn't even request or look into it to be honest with you Asel. i i have so much stuff Thank you for the follow. I will, I appreciate it. I'll try to catch uh, some of the mod run. I really enjoyed that mod last year. Oh, did you do it? Nice. No, you'll really like Lollop though, I promise. Uh, so yeah, rip my ears volume warning. Agreed. Um, let me... I'm going to pause this for a second. So this is Lollop. Like I said, really cool person. You should definitely check them out. And if anybody came over in the raid and didn't follow Lollop when you were there freaking turn your ass around and go drop that lady a follow because she's awesome i'm gonna remove my face for a second i'll probably laugh again uh i know this has a volume warning because i was there live um but this shit was hilarious so just just watch this and then go follow lollop if you haven't already quiet i hope you're doing well by the way it's good to see you okay <laughs> the footsteps i forgot about the footsteps <laughs> what do you guys want what do you want what do you want? What do you want? Do you want space <laughs> <laughs> It seriously was an ear warning. I knew it was coming, but I was like, I don't remember. Oh, <laughs> it's so broken, dude. It's so broken. <laughs> Hang on. I think there's another one where it's the oh, fucking shit. I don't remember if this is the same. I was, I was, I'm literally in tears now thinking about it again. It's so funny. I love that you can open windows. <laughs> <laughs> I was okay. Yeah, it was that one. Oh my god. Seriously, I'm in like. Anywho, um, for the record, Lollop's really cool. Um, and plays a whole heckin variety of games and I had found her because of quiet quiet actually raided me in there one day and she was playing um, Hydraneer, which I ended up getting my partner addicted to afterwards <laughs> <laughs> um, So please seriously go check out Lollop uh, and thank you for choosing me to raid today I really really appreciate you bringing your community over and coming and hanging out for a bit it's been, it's been a last couple of days. Yeah. <laughs> also, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. I appreciate it. But seriously, I know I've said it like 10 times now, but I do want to show appreciation for Lollop and just being a really awesome person because they are very cool. Please go check them out. 
But yeah, that was called like crew flight sim, crew cabin crew simulator or something. It was during the next fest. The game was broken. And I'm not just saying that it was funny because of that, but just the commentary that Lullop had and stuff was really funny. Hi, PJs. How are you doing? Thank you for getting another shout out for Lullop. You came just in time. You did. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I tried to warn you all and she has a warning in the title or in the clip title. Rob King of Plans, thank you for the 55 bits. I appreciate you. So yeah, once again, everyone, welcome in. Happy to have you. Feel free to stick around as little or as long as you like. I know this is a bit different than Project Zomboid. For the record, I am a very big Project Zomboid lover. I went through like 400 hours of it on stream at one point. Uh, don't be surprised if we go back to it uh, when the 42 build comes around. We actually just wrapped up a community server a month and a half ago. So I do plan on hosting another community server in the near future uh, when Build 42 is stable for multiplayer, which could still take a while because I know there's testing for Build 42, then they're going to isolate it to single player first and et cetera. So. And thank you for the follow. Again, follows are anonymous. You can lurk, you can chat. Whatever makes you feel comfortable around here. That's a fucking gorilla. That's not good. Gorillas do not make me comfortable. Seriously. Fuck off. You asshole. No! <laughs> you know what? That's the best timeline. Reload and it's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. The jank is always heavy. <laughs> Rob King Plans, thank you for the 55 bits, though. I appreciate it. PJs, how are you doing today? It's good to see you. Also, I don't think I mentioned it, but Lollip, if you need a raid and run or anything like that, you probably already have dipped, but if you do need a raid and run or anything, please take care of yourself. I know you're across the ocean from me, so it's already midnight time, your time. I had fun letting you murder me at the end of it. It was honestly really fun picking me, and like I, I was getting brutal towards the end because I'm like, okay, I, I got stuff I need to do, so we know to wrap up this a little bit, but... I was having fun with it. You all were making it a very hard challenge, honestly. Yeah, why have I not been using the shotgun? That was so much easier. <laughs> there better be a lead bar here or something. Not another goddamn gorilla though. Get out of here. I'm I'm over it. Something tells me I have to do some stupid gymnastics here. Oh, there's a med kit over there. Oh, I, do I jump there? I think I jump there. Not sure, we'll figure it out. I've got this. I am a, a killer of fellow primates, it's true. In the original, that's her man, King of Plants. You have Rob has got a crazy memory. The very first time that I played. Wait, how do I get it? The very first time I played Project Zomboid, like literally the first day, I didn't know what the hell to do, and I followed train tracks, and it led me in the middle of nowhere, and it was shit. <laughs> there we go. It wasn't letting me get it for some reason. All right, med kit achieved. Now don't fuck this up. You know what? I'm saving again. I'm going to save so much. It's fine. What's up, B Blackbird? How are you doing? You're fine. What the heck? Right into the teeth of the lion. It's so appropriate. <laughs> Well, it's weird because there's no backup button on the modern controls. There, that's what I was trying to do. It just didn't work out. It's fine. Definitely shows some good guns. True. Gorilla with lead bars for hands. Um, only if I can take the bars afterwards, Marilith. You Blackbird, I hope you're doing well. Also, hi Blaster, how are you? Hey, at least I saved. I was smart-ish. I hear a bat. I hear a bat. Get off the wall, off the wall, off the wall, off the wall. Where's my guns? I hear it. I hear another one. I couldn't see it. 
That's not fair. Eh. Okay. D don't. That was a terrible sound. Okay. I'm progressing. As long as there's a way forward and there's a lead bar at the end of this, I'm happy. If there's not a lead bar, I won't be happy because <laughs> that means I've missed it. I'm assuming each one of these doors takes you to a lead bar. Obviously that could be wrong, but... And I'd mentioned earlier, but anybody that's new around here, this is my first time ever playing a Tomb Raider game, so... <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing, but it's fine. That's typically how most of the playthroughs go around here. Okay, well those break. Ooh, no. Is that water down there? Oh my god, okay. Do I want to go down there? I don't think I do, but we'll find out. Was this way first? I can just reload the save if it's wrong. I have no idea where I am now. Why? Why intense music? Lion. I was gonna say, why does it feel like it's taking forever to kill that thing? Oh, you already finished it, you blackbird. I've been meaning to ask what your thoughts were on it. The music's so good in this game. Okay, so hang on. I'm gonna save here. I do want to know what would have happened if I went the other way. Real quick. Cause is that water? It looks like water. Is, is that water? That's definitely water, so... Oh, this is this area! Oh, I'm so glad I didn't... Ah, ha, 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 okay, cool. I chose correctly. Cool. Alright. I mean, it's fun to play... <laughs> Fuck, I shouldn't have been reading chat, but... I'm glad I have a save there. Uh, it's fun to play. I like the level. I like how the level keeps intertwining with itself. Veliki. I think that's really cool level design, honestly. Love the landing animation. She looks so fucked up, like basically bitten in impossible angles. Well, I mean, that makes sense, right? If you fall from that height, your your bones are going to do some... You ain't going to look the same anymore. It was a bit... Lara, please jump when I press the A button. Please. Please, I'm begging you. It's interesting that you say that, E. Blackbird. Why are you not jumping? <laughs> La! Sorry. I don't know why she's not jumping. This way. This way. There! I don't know why it wasn't jumping. I swear it was pressing, but it was like the inputs were slightly delayed. <laughs> I swear I was... Ah, that's a gator! I swear I was pressing it, though. I need one of those things on screen that shows that I'm pressing stuff. <laughs> and then I can be mad when I go back and watch it and be like, oh, I was pressing it too late. <laughs> I'm glad you enjoyed it, E Blackbird, but you're not the first person I've heard say that, which is really interesting about the ending specifically. Someone did remaster the music for the first three games, but this doesn't use remastered sound. Thank you, Asel, for letting me know. I appreciate it. Whoop, hang on. Bats and a jump. Yay, I found a lead bar. Let's go. Okay. <gasps> no! <laughs> Thank God for saves. 
Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, Lara! <laughs> the controls, man. The controls. Oh, yeah. I appreciate it. Yeah. Um, try not to foreshadow anything. I know sometimes people get excited. Like, it's fine to be like, oh, I really, like, I enjoy this level when we get there kind of concept. That's fine. But if it's anything, like, more than that, like, oh, just wait until this next part or something like that. Please, no foreshadowing. Thank you for understanding. And thank you for keeping me safe, mods. Oh, goodness. All right. Well, it was unfortunate. I was like, please jump. I don't know if you guys could hear me. I was literally spamming the click button or the jump button. Yep. I appreciate you understanding, though. I know it's a little bit, I don't know. It seems harsher than some places, but like at the same time, we're just trying to preserve the, the experience. So, like I said, I appreciate you all understanding. That's how it, how it works. Nothing bad like comes from it. I feel like some people, and again, you're not doing this fellow here. For the most part, a community is really good and understands that having a message deleted doesn't mean anything like horrible for you. Some people treat it like, oh my god, I can never go back from this. But thank you for understanding. Yeah, no big deal at all. So about those modern controls, it just felt like there was an input issue, Rob Co, and it might have been me. <laughs> okay, hang on. I know there are some lions down here. Okay, we're good. Are the controls a little sloppier, like Mega Man 2 on NES sloppy? No, not that bad, Chef Odin. There are two different ways to play this game. There's the original tank controls that premiered whenever the game originally launched, and there's also modern controls. I am using modern controls. Some people have words and opinions against that, but at the same time, it felt easier to me to play. And uh, for the most part, I'm fine with the modern controls, but I do feel like there's every once in a while there seems to be a little input delay. And I think that's actually by design in the game. So. Hi, Briggy. You're a big old stinker. What are you doing up so late? It's Thursday. I guess it's not like that that late. I'm just whenever I see people from across the ocean, I'm immediately like, what day is it? <laughs> what day is it? What year is it? Yeah, so I don't think, like, I feel like the controls are fine uh, for the most part, oh. Chef Odin, but I've also had a couple weird, like, input issues, and I, I think that might be some of the, the old game, because apparently there were some input stuff. Uh, it does feel better, like, I don't feel like it happens a lot, but every once in a while I'm like, I am definitely pushing this button, but it doesn't feel like I am because of the way it's registering. I'm going the wrong way. So... Yeah, that's fair, Redneck, yeah. And it's kind of hard to do that. It is hard to update some games to modern controls for sure. And in those cases, I would just play whatever they gave me. Exactly, pick me, exactly. And like, yeah, it's, and it's hard to know every community. We just try to keep it as like a genuine first reaction as I can for everything. And so like, I, I got nothing, nobody's doing anything wrong right now. So this is just like in general knowledge. Like I appreciate people understanding that like we want to experience things at the, as they happen. One of the funniest things that happened in Liza P for example, I'm so happy and proud of like how well the community like restrained itself in different areas with that game, uh, especially <laughs> with the stupid weapon. <laughs> Um, at the very beginning of the game, the second merchant you can even talk to in the game had a weapon that I missed. And um, I, I was very upset because at like during my playthrough of it, I was like, man, I feel like I should have gotten a shock weapon by now. Like there's so many puppets. I feel like I should have gotten a shock weapon like da 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 da. The second fucking merchant sold one, <laughs> and I discovered that after I already beat the game, but I was still live on stream, and it just created a really, really funny moment of me being like, no way was this here the whole goddamn time. So yeah, it creates fun, fun moments whenever I don't know something's coming up or whatever the case may be. So it's, it's always appreciated, and my mods do the best they can. Uh, especially with games that they're not familiar with. I my my mods do an incredible job and I appreciate the heck out of them and their their willingness to help me and try to navigate stuff. So thank you mods. I I truly do you you make this so much easier to do what I do every day. 
and you're obviously volunteering your time to do so, so I appreciate it. We need like a mod love day. I appreciate my mods every day, but we should have a mod, mod joy. I need the pets the mods emote. I'll have to add that, Paula. I got rid of a bunch of BTTV emotes because I had planned on getting rid of like my service with them, but I used too many of them, so I need to. Yeah, I removed a bunch of them down to the 50 mark because I was going to cancel it because going full-time streaming, I have to have to keep an eye on finances a lot more than I used to. Uh, but I've decided that it's worth keeping that. So I'm going to be re-adding a bunch of BTT emotes. So if you're in the Discord, in the suggestion section, feel free to uh, add any of the ones or like post suggestions of any of the ones you'd like to see. Uh, and I'll try to re-add them in the next few days because I need to redo that anyway. Um, hmm, this looks sketchy. <laughs> Yeah, you can also do that. <laughs> you can pay to have more pick me. I think it's five or seven dollars a month, which again is not a lot, but when you're going full time content creation, there's a lot of stuff that I used to do out of my own money and like especially because I had two jobs. But uh in this case I I wanted to make sure that my finances were in order before um having like, you know, all the different subscriptions and stuff. So uh, but I'll keep that one because we use a lot of BTTV features and I've been supporting them since like three years ago. Also, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Follows are anonymous. Feel free to lurk, chit chat, whatever you're vibing with. We're just playing some Tomb Raider 1 for the first time. That's a good point, Veliki, because it does seem like there's some nuances to the old, to the old like... <laughs> control scheme for this game that I am kind of surprised that the modern controls were adapted so well because there is a lot of precision that's going into this. Okay, so I need to do that. It probably lowers the spikes and then I need to get on each of those maybe. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and save one more time. I know I'm, I'm saving so much, but I'm okay with that. <laughs> But yes, pick me if you would like more, you can. And that also adds more to your Discord. If I'm not mistaken, I think it was 50 more emotes for every month that you support. And that's like as long as you're keeping it going. So I think I can have something like a thousand emotes now. <laughs> I'm playing it so safe, but that's okay. <laughs> I am safe scumming the fuck out of this game. <laughs> the fuck kind of noise was that? Jesus. I don't know if going up here was the right idea, if I should have went the other way. Oh God, what is this? Oh God, what is this? Oh God, please don't tell me this is on a timer. Oh God, okay. Please don't let me fuck up the inputs this time. No! <laughs> Ah, go on! Why is it up? It wasn't the last jump. It was the second to last jump this time, but still! Ugh, okay. That's fair, fella Keith. Very fair. Which means they put a lot into it if they completely... <gasps> I bonked my head. Damn it. <clears throat> As I was saying... <laughs> Hi, Shark. How are you doing? Good to see you. That noise is horrible. Good to see you. How are you doing today? It was a good sequence with no loads. It was nice until I got spiked, Veliki. But it was. I felt like I was... The thing about it is, like, I'm confident with platformers, so... Like, I knew I was going to miss that, so I was like, maybe I can still grab it? No, damn it. I say I'm confident and then I fuck it up. But in general, I am confident with platformers and I like them, so. I don't think there's a. All right. Ear annoyance. 
I really hate that sound. You know what? I'm loading up here so I don't have to hear that sound again. It's so bad. Those are spikes, Yonder Yonder. You are correct. You are the best kind of correct. You're technically correct. The best kind of correct. All right. Save that real quick so I don't have to hear it again. It's so terrible. I do not like that noise. I keep bunking my head right there. Why? Lara! You know what? I'll run all the way back. I don't care. It's fine. Yonder, how are you doing today? It's good to see you. Thanks for the rips. Um, Briggy said snotty. Are you sick, Briggy? Are you not feeling well? If so, I'm sorry to hear that. Yoink, yoink, yoink. Boop. Hi, Malk. How are you doing? All the Brits are coming in late tonight. What the heck? Oof. Okay. I'm rewalking this one back. Okay, there we go. Laura, why? Why didn't you jump? <laughs> ah! Sometimes the jump input drives me nuts. Literally, like, I don't know if you can hear it, but I'm like clicking the hell out of this thing sometimes whenever I, it's like not going. I'm like, please! <laughs> Lara, like... Okay, that time I tried walking and she sprinted instead. <laughs> Fuck's sake. It's the boringest, pathetic sickness. I'm sorry that you feel sick anyway. That just sucks. Well, I hope you feel better quickly. At least you have Jaspie and the cats to keep you company. And of course your partner, but yeah. Animals. <laughs> okay. Just like really making sure I'm good. Okay. See, I think I'm gonna bonk my head here. You know what? This one I'm actually gonna save for. Because it's like a short jump and I do have problems with the short jump on, on modern controls. Because it's like, you're supposed to kind of like flick it almost. It didn't do it again, so. This is the one time I feel like modern controls suck a little bit because there's like the short jump kind of thing. And I have a hard time triggering it. Oh, well that time it triggered, it just went the wrong direction, so. Cause like there's a way to like flick the stick and do a short jump, but it's very like weird how it works. There we go. That's exactly what I wanted to do. Monkey, no, 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 monkey, no, no, let me, monkey, this, this is mine now, monkey, get the fuck out of here, wait, 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 what am I doing, shotgun this bitch, <laughs> yeah, it's now dead too, yonder, that's a dead monkey, <laughs> Okay, now I gotta make sure I don't fuck this up. Yeah, it'll be fine. Oh, so close! We're fine. That's always been the case for this game. Yeah, it's got, it's just, it's a little finicky. You gotta like stand on one leg, stick your tongue out to the side. Very glit, very glid, very busy, but glad I made it. Well, I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you're doing well. Brigitte, I hope you feel better, though, very quickly. It is always annoying to get sick, regardless of what kind of sick you are, so. <laughs> the pyramid boobs are dragging her forward. Uh, I can tell you about the jump if it issues if you wish to invoke the pineapple. When you say about the jump issues, is it, like, mechanically for the game, like, in general? Or, like, just how to prompt it better? Cause I, I like, I understand the, I understand the short jump now. It's just, it's kind of funky because of like the way you have to do it. Cause you've got the run jump, but then you also have the standstill like shorter hop jump. And now I get it. You literally have to flick the stick. So like, I understand it. It's just a little finicky. And I know in the tank controls, you can like back up and like line up. So 
mechanically in the game you can totally talk about that rob king of plants you're fine that that's something you can talk about um which just for the mod's sake i'll go ahead and throw the pineapple there um because that's that's fine like the differences the nuances that's that's okay because the modern controls are what i'm using and so it may not even correlate to this anyway she doesn't like to jump near edges very annoying yeah i've kind of noticed that terry i've definitely noticed that so yeah, the, the, the pineapple's more for the, the mods in this case, just in case there anybody's lurking. Um, okay. And then the last one. Poor monkey, better than monkey, that's for sure. I would hope you're doing better than monkey. I would freaking hope so. But speedy recovery. <laughs> Have a good lurk yonder. Thanks for being here. I appreciate it. Hi, Charmander. How are you doing? How's work been treating you? All right. Final. Oh! <laughs> I was about to save. <laughs> uh, I don't know if you can see, but right above the shotgun is a fucking lion about to try to eat my face. Um, well, this is awkward. I think I still have the shotgun equipped, right? So, run! <laughs> no! What? No, you bitch! <laughs> Where was I? Oh, what? I didn't save after this? I'm such an idiot. Where's the monkey? <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> damn it. I was literally like, okay, perfect. This is a good time to save. <laughs> uh, okay. I'm doing all right. Okay, that's good. I, I'm doing all right, Charmander. I'm doing all right. Thank you for asking. I appreciate it. The running jump seemed to leave too, mo too little space for enough steps. If I recall, when jumping from moving, she needs to be moving long enough. Okay, thank you, Rob King of Plants. That's fair. Hi, Michael. There once was a weeb named Side who. Oh, damn it. Something that rhymes with side, so I'm just gonna call you a weeb. <laughs> It didn't even read my name out correctly anyway, so I was like, oh, it's gonna rhyme! Michael, thank you for the 11 months with your Prime. Thanks for choosing me as your Prime for the month. I appreciate it. Enjoy the emotes and ad free viewing. Work has gotten really busy, but I am not hating like, the last job. That is a massive improvement. I'm really glad to hear that, Charmander. I'm very, very happy to hear that. I was messaging my friend earlier. It's like the only friend I have in town. That sounds so depressing, but that's a whole different story. Um, but I say story as if there's like a lot that goes into it. It's it's just a tale of me coming here and then, yeah. Anyway, that's that's neither here nor there. But my one friend that lives in town, um, she messaged me today with some, some sad news and... Uh, we used to work at the same company together as well. And she's like, I am just despising it. And it sounds like I got out when I should have, basically. But Michael, enjoy your your emotes and ad-free viewing. Thank you very, very much for choosing me as your prime. I appreciate it. I hope you're well. Are you doing all right? I'm doing all right. Juice, I'm just as I am. I am doing all right. I'm doing all right. I'm glad you're doing all right. <laughs> I am. I am making it. Okay, that the jump thing. I just need to jump. St sit like still. Here. Oh no! Oh god! I fucked up. Hang on. That was not great. <laughs> Laura's not doing. All right, there we go. Nice See, song. I know how to do it. I know how to trigger. Oh shit! I should have changed the shotgun. Grab the bar. Grab the bar. Monkey, stop. <laughs> Aha, monkey. Now like boo. <laughs> okay. I survived, bitch. Yeah, let's see you get out of that. It will 100% get out of that and kill me probably. I I will save this time, I promise. 
Michael, 1977. Oh wait, did you just do the tier th or the the three months again, or is that the conclusion of the three months? I hate how they word it because it confuses me. Thank you so much, Michael, 1977, for the, the, the tier one for three months in advance. Because I think that's the next set, if I'm not mistaken. Thank you so much. How are you doing? All the Michaels, all the Michaels been supporting. Thank you, Michaels. And Michael, 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 and Michael. And Michael with the double L's is somewhere here, too, I think. That was not great, though. <laughs> that was not great. So, good thing monkeys are notoriously bad at jumping and climbing. I know, right? Thank God this game is accurate. <laughs> uh, I need a heal, though. Um... All right, we'll use the big one. That's probably the first time I've had full health in a long time. <laughs> uh, oh wait, whoops, that's not what I meant to do. I will save before going against the lion this time. I just was like, oh, this will be a good place right before I get into this next room, which we don't know what horrors await us. Well, the horror that awaited us was the freaking scary lion with gr like creepy teeth. All right, so we're gonna save here. <laughs> That's a lot better save spot. <laughs> okay, wait. The shotgun did not kill it instantly, but I'm still gonna use the shotgun. Cause why not? Yeah, it's a good thing monkeys are just, you know, monkeys are just monkeys. Justice, how are you doing? What are you gonna be streaming this month? I know you were doing a lot of the horror stuff last last month. Did I also, random question, did I see you on the storage hunter simulator? Were you on that? Or am I misremembering? No lying about saving before the lion, indeed. <laughs> have you tried finding a dentist out there? I have not, it's not for a while. Okay, lions take two, monkeys take one. I think that's a little biased, but we're going with it. For the king too. Is that the side scrolling one? Is that what it is? Thank you for getting a shout out for Justice. They're really cool. I am quite happy. 3x gold. Which we we actually have three lead. Oh! Wait, so this is where we need to go. So I need to go get the lead now. And there's gonna be a monkey up here. Because I heard it. I heard it. Or it's gonna be waiting for me, one or the other. It's waiting for me somewhere, so I need to go get the gold bars. And this is where they go. Wait, is the monkey in here? Hello? Brother, hello? <laughs> God, I'm sorry. <laughs> nobody. I, I say nobody. Maybe like three people will get that reference. Thank you, Robco. Thank you for laughing. <laughs> so sorry. It giggled. It giggled me. It tickled me some fierce. It's like the funniest thing to me. God, knock is great. That's <laughs> uh, because these are monkeys. These are apes and gorillas. So it's too hard for them. Skinny, small monkeys climb things. It's true. Uh, brother, we're out there. Depends. Also, it's funny because Mimat also says hello like that very clearly. But he, I don't think he really says brother hello. But I'm referring to Nux's version of brother hello. Because it was just so funny to me. <laughs> Lama and I were in a VC. So it's, I'll explain for everybody else. Neckbone, also known as Nuck, um, was playing a horror game. And Llama and I were in VC and we were just chit chatting, shooting the breeze, and like playing games and stuff. And then um, Nuck, <laughs> he gets scared pretty easily. So do I. I'm not saying anything about that. But he, he gets scared pretty easily. And so his default is like, brother, hello. And he says it just like that. And he says it a lot. Um, 
<laughs> but uh, it was so funny because at one point, Llama and I are both like, can he say something else besides brother hello or just hello in general? Because he just kept saying it. And so... <laughs> We at one point I was like Fendi, can we please get a counter for how many times he says brother hello? <laughs> and so uh Nuck was like, I don't get I don't say brother hello that often. And then I'm not joking. Five seconds later, not joking, five seconds later, wasn't ironically said, he says it. <laughs> By the end of like an hour, he'd said it like 16 times and Again, I had a blast that stream. I laughed so hard and it was very entertaining and Nuck has been playing horror games recently. Um, so go give them a follow. <laughs> and then you can, you can see how many times he says brother hello. Uh, it's not giving me the icon. Hang on, what the heck? Um, hello? See, I said hello there. And say brother hello? Why, why are you not giving me the icon this time? I have three. Um, I have three. Oh, it gave me the hand that time. There we go. Yes. Okay, why is she struggling with those when she doesn't struggle with like moving an entire pillar to collapse a column what the hell this is cool i love this puzzle though dave how are you doing it's good to see you at least we don't have super brother here oh shit i didn't mean to do that we don't have to listen to super brother constantly We've got Brother Hello and Supa Brother. <laughs> Almost looks like the Carlton in a way. But Dave, I hope you're doing well. It's good to see you. Hi, Grits. It's alchemy. It is. We're so good. Guess who's going to save again? Because reasons. <laughs> But this is definitely the level that I like remember seeing people on and like had problems with. I don't know if there's a way to open those. Super brother. Super brother. Super. Now nah, it's going to get stuck in my head. Nope. Nope. I don't have it around here, so. Ha. No one give her a hand. She's got a huge one right there. That turns things to gold, too, Silverhawk. It's nice. That's a very good point, Rob King of Plants. She isn't. Finally on my second cup of coffee, so I feel like a normal person. That's fair. I could totally go for a frappe right now. My sleep schedule's been so far off, I'm like awake during the time that McDonald's is actually closed or closed because, oh, fuck, I haven't, I need to call them again. I still don't have my car window fixed. That's an, another problem for another day. It's kind of getting ridiculous at this point, but that's okay. Nice. Look at me. I'm so proud of me. I feel like a lot of people have struggled with this level, at least that I've watched. So I'm proud of this one. Hi, Jill. How are you doing? Well, it's all thanks to you that I even started playing. I'm, this, I'm finally getting back to it after the raid train because I've been trying to get through Liza P, which has been incredible. I loved Liza P. It was so good. Cannot wait for DLC or the second one. We're both really. But I'm finally getting back to Tomb Raider, and then we'll play this. We're only going to play one for now, but I do plan on playing all three of them. Like, the three remasters. I'm going to try to get... 
Okay, I figured that was the end of the level. I was just guessing because the way the, the door was designed. Man, that took me a while. But hey, I, I actually felt like I did a good job in that one. Um, but yeah, I'm going to try to get through all three of them before the next set of remasters come out, which is February 14th, 4, 5, and 6 are then going to be coming out, which would be really cool. So I'm going to kind of split them up, though, because I have to get into Cyberpunk and Mass Effect because those have been on the docket for like ever. And today was in seven, and originally I was going to try to shoot for streaming Mass Effect today, but didn't end up, the time didn't line up, so. But Jill, how are you doing? It's so good to see you. Yeah, I'm really enjoying it. I, I don't know that, I know you and I talked about it at one point, but this is like whenever we first met. The only Tomb Raider game I had ever played before this was a Game Boy Color game called Curse of the Sword. And it was when I was a kid. And so I've been meaning to play Tomb Raider for literally eons. So it was you like inviting to the to the team in the raid train to to get me to finally play it, which sounds bad. Like I wanted to play it, but I know you understand how big a backlog is and trying to Ow! Rat! What the heck? No! No, 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 no! No! Screw you! Stop it! Rat! <laughs> no! <laughs> I, okay, sir. Can you? Why are you so chunky? Okay, I didn't panic. You panicked. Anyway, thank you, Jill, for for influencing me to finally actually pick this up. Uh, I don't know, uh, Scarlet or one of the mods. Can you please give a shout out to Jill? She's wonderful. She's amazing. She also speeds run Tomb Raider, and Lara Croft is like her biggest hero, and I can see why. She's really fun. She's an awesome character, and actually gives a little, gives some some woman power where it's due. So, everybody, go check out Jill though. She's really awesome. She's the leader of the highlight stream team, which I'm a part of, and we were also a part of the Tomb Raider raid train. That was two weeks, three weeks ago. My weeks are running together. Three weeks ago now. Um, so. Yeah, please check her out. Thank you for getting the double shout outs. Because, yeah, you all should check out Jill. She's wonderful. She plays a heck of variety of stuff. She's back on Sekiro because you were doing Sekiro runs the other day. So Jill Speed runs a couple different games, uh, but Tomb Raider and Sekiro. And I know she had records at one point. I don't know which records you currently have. But, yeah, Jill's wonderful. So please go check her out if you haven't done so already. So, but yeah, it's good to see you. Yes, she does speed runs of Sekiro Scarlet, and it's so freaking impressive. <laughs> like, I think I actually, I don't remember. No, I, I did my Sekiro 100% last year. But when I started watching Jill play, and especially after trying Liza P and like loving the hell out of Liza P, and because I did Deathless on New Game Plus 5 of Sekiro, I really want to try a speed run of it because I think I could do it. Now, I would have to practice a bunch again because I haven't played Sekiro since last year, but I think it would be a fun game to speed run. Like 30 to 40 minutes, so. Hi, Xena. Talk about another wonderful woman. Um, thanks to everybody that like reached out because I've been dealing with some depression stuff over the last few days, like full transparency. Uh, Zena has been wonderful and has been very, very supportive as well. So thank you, Zena, for uplifting me. I haven't checked my P.O. box yet. I'm sorry. I didn't end up leaving my house yesterday. So. Oh, I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. <laughs> I should have pushed instead of pulled, and I didn't. <laughs> It's going quite all right, Messina. I, I'm enjoying Tomb Raider. I'm glad to be back on it. I, I've been wanting to play it ever since the, the raid train, and we were just playing a bunch of other stuff. There's so many things going on right now. Liza P is so good, Jill. Oh my gosh, I loved it. Like, it, it's up there as one of my favorite Souls likes, and even of the Souls games pretty much of all time. It was such an experience. I loved it. I loved a lot of the bosses, and I am super excited about the future of it. I'm currently going through New Game Plus right now of it. Can I not push it over this? Oh, wait a second. Is this a... Oh, that's a lever. I couldn't tell that was a lever. I'm a dingus. That would have been so much more obvious. We're gonna go, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. Ha <laughs> ha 
See, clearly I've never watched Jill's speedruns like super, super closely. Cause I should know all these things, but and I've watched Jill play this a lot. <laughs> That'd be kind of cool, Robco. I mean, if you really identify with Mass Effects. I mean, obviously you identify with Fallout. Oh, I can't wait, Xena. I, I after stream tonight, I don't even care if it's late. I'll I'll go. I'll go get it. So can't wait for the DLC. Me either. I, I've truly Liza P is what I've been playing a lot of recently and God, it's so incredible. Ooh, speaking of incredible, this looks cool. Let me save. I don't think I've saved since I've been in this level yet. Okay. All right, so we got rats this time. Okay, we're good. That looks like the main path. Door up there, door there. Two locked doors there. The music is so good. I know I say that like every time the music plays, I almost wish it was more constant. And I like push this off. It looks like it's pushable. Okay, I'm gonna try jumping to this just to see. Yeah. Uh, keys, we need keys here, okay. Keys for both of those. Okay, I'm assuming we just jump in the water here. What's over there? There's a rat over there, but hang on. Can I hit? Yeah, of course I can. Oh, I didn't know. Could, that's never mind. Just never mind. Just never mind. What I was gonna say it was gonna be very silly there. Cave sub three minute win. Never. I'll leave that to the professionals like Jill. <laughs> Changed her name and I forgot who she was for like a whole month. Yeah, because I took the ninety off. Also, we have an ad break in one minute and thirty seconds. Just as a heads up. Sorry, everybody. Who the Liza P woman is. <laughs> so. Hang on. Yoink. Okay, there we go. Jill, don't be don't be sad with me. I am playing modern controls, I'm sorry. <laughs> this is a great level. I'm looking forward to checking it out. Classic TR music. It's really pretty. You can't wait to start that. It looks super fun. Uh Liza P Terry, it's so good. At least there are some people who don't care for it as much. I loved it, like truly such a good experience. Okay, I can go, there's a key over there. Okay, hang on. Sometimes switching between the two, I can see items a lot easier. Okay, so let's grab this then. It looks really good, like, not her boobs. Well, her boobs look good too, but I, I meant the level. <laughs> I do too, Kat. Uh, I said Kathy and I was going to say Terry instead, but I do too. <laughs> yeah, I was like, this looks beautiful. Immediately pans to her boobs. And I'm like, D yeah, but <laughs> not quite what it meant. <laughs> okay, that looks like it comes out that way. There's so much. There's another key thing there too. Okay. Uh, hang on. Is that it? No, there's nothing there. Okay. Oh, nope. I knew I was going to do that. That's okay. Some of the controls I'm still getting there. Actually, what does the number 17 represent, Robco? I don't actually know if I ever asked that. Sorry. I feel like I probably should have. I like knowing the origins of people's names. Hi, me, Matt. I am. I'm doing modern controls. And that's okay. Because guess what? It still works for me. <laughs> actually, me, Matt, I was just talking about you a minute ago. So if your ears were burning, what? Fuck this guy's back! No! Get out of here! No! Sir! Get the hell out of here! You get out of here! Get, get, get! Jerk. Damn it! I don't know what that is. 
is Blaster? What is it? Oh, shoot. Ads are going. I'll wait a second. I'll just look very pretty. Right. Nope. I'll just look pretty there for a second. Ugh. Cut that and take it out of context. Everybody always does, Grits. Everybody always does. So... What did I do? Okay, so you know how you say hello like that? And it's kind of like a thing. So the other day I was in uh, another friend's stream and they kept saying brother hello. And it one, reminded me of you. And two, it was hilarious because they just kept saying it because they were getting scared in a game. <laughs> so it made me laugh. Brother hello. I always look pretty. Thank you, Scarlett. Thank you. I, I try so hard in my t-shirts and my one hair look. <laughs> I wish I could do a lot more. I'm not Blaster, but I'll have to look it up because I do like to broaden my gaming knowledge. I'm such a brother brother. I can't say brother anymore. Xena will yell at me. <laughs> Okay, that's not true, but uh, during the trucking sim. <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> yeah, then we kept counting with a command. Yeah, I was talking about this story a minute ago, Llama. Like, I told the whole story <laughs> about Nux thing. It was great. I can't help it. It's fine. It's fine. It wasn't on you, but it was 16 times in our friend Nux stream. And that was only after we started counting, so... Oh, okay. Got you, Blaster. Thanks for letting me know. Oh, wait. Robco, I missed your, your message about what the 17 meant. I apologize. Could you repost it? And also, if I've missed anything else, please repost. I'm trying to keep up with it. And once I have a vertical monitor, that will help tremendously. But that's when I get the new PC stuff set up. I'm actually wondering, Rube, are you here right now? And if you're flying, it's okay. You don't have to answer. But I got a question for you. Hi. You wanted to be able to play Arma when you were here, right? And that's perfectly fine if you do. Like, I'm just asking you real quick because it might change. So I was going to set up my new, my setup next week, but obviously you already know that I'm not going to be able to do that now. And that's just going to postpone it a whole nother week. So it's going to be less than a month before you get here. So I might just go ahead and leave that PC alone. And then if you want to stream and stuff, I'll just set it up like right before you leave. And then you can even help me troubleshoot or something. Because that would be so much easier than setting up another monitor in here for you to play off the other PC. And it's way more powerful than my laptop is, so. Okay. Um, I won't change to that setup then. And that would be kind of a nice way to start the new year. New year, new setup kind of situation. I know, but, like, that just makes way more sense. Hi, Allie. How are you doing? Welcome back, people from ads. I apologize. I, I had missed that it had already started, so I waited a second for you guys to get back. Um, and if I missed anything in chat or if I didn't answer a question or something you had or a comment, please repost it because I might have started answering it not knowing who could hear me and who couldn't. So I apologize. Playing Arma, what a stinky nerd. Yeah, I wonder why Rube likes playing Arma so much, Briggy. <laughs> but yeah, I'll... Because like literally that would be like almost three weeks before you came here and I know you want to play Arma and stuff and if you wanted to stream you could literally just use that again you'd have to bring you know some of your stuff again if you wanted to stream but you are here for almost a month so wait did I pull that lever originally I didn't even think I saw that lever until just now hang on Nuke. what does this do I'm not quite sure what it did, but it did something. Water related. Oh, interesting. Thanks for the context, Acel. I appreciate it. 
It got lost with all the Double Dragon Bad Dudes Streets of Rage. See, I know Double Dragon and Streets of Rage. I don't even know what Bad Dudes is. Thanks for explaining a little bit of that. Ali, how are you doing, though? It's good to see you. I hope you're doing well today. Hi, Bob. How are you? How's your oblivion been going? I hope it's been good. Yeah, we are playing the OG Tomb Raider. Now, this is the remaster, which is why right now it looks nicer, but I have been switching back and forth between... Uh, between them thank you for getting a shout out for bob does stuff they were very kind and rated us not too terribly long ago i think it was the last time i was playing on oblivion or maybe it wasn't i was on oblivion but they're playing oblivion for like the first time and uh obviously i love oblivion so please go check them out oh damn it it didn't grab hang on i have to do the short jumpies i think here to get the grab correct Nope. I will get this. Okay. Short jumpies. Okay. It kind of works, but just a little odd direction. Like, I totally get how the modern controls are supposed to work with this. Just sometimes I still fuck it up. Nope. Come on, Laura. We got this. We got this. We could totally do this. Forward, back. There we go. That's what I wanted to do. Yay! All right. There we go. Cool. Now just don't fall off before grabbing the items. <laughs> You ink. Oh wait, there's oh there's an item there too. Hang on. I probably wouldn't have seen that otherwise. Uppies. Oh wait, or was this the way I was supposed to go? I don't know, but we're we're figuring it out. Maybe this is the way I was supposed to go. <laughs> Seventeen was the year I graduated. I also seventeen when I made it. Uh, there's also another reason, but it's very doxy. Oh, okay, gotcha. Sorry, yeah, I guess I should say only in the case that you want to answer something like that. But that's cool. I'm glad it has a lot of meaning to you, though. Uppies, we like uppies. Okay, I can do this. Also, this was a secret area, so this wasn't the right way to go. Is Uppies from Liz? I think so. I think she said it one day. She was also another person that I watched play this. Dude, Liz is fantastic. There's so many incredible people that I enjoy watching on this platform. It's actually ridiculous. So if you ever hear me be like, man, CD like talks about all these people that she thinks is really cool. No joke, I watch a lot of them. <laughs> a lot of my free time and a lot of times that I'm working through like emails or whatever it is that I need to be doing, a lot of that is spent watching other people or at least keeping their streams up. So, so you're like, man, CD mentions all these people. Like, I bet she doesn't even watch them. But yes, I do. <laughs> I have no life. <laughs> He stole my graduation year. Thank you for reposting. I appreciate it. I apologize for missing stuff. I try my best. I, I seriously do think the vertical monitor will help like immensely with not missing things because I'll have literally almost twice the length of screen that I have right now to be able to like see upwards so that if chat's moving very quick or whatever or shout outs take you know a big chunk of the thing that I can see it a lot easier so I'm glad you're enjoying it Bob I feel like we've confirmed that with other things too that's fair <laughs> I got you Robco well if it's important to you I mean whatever you think is the best I never thought I would change my username and now I've been streaming lining all my social medias that I can. I needed my dumb joke to be heard. Vertical monitor is nice. Yeah, I've never used a vertical monitor, but definitely need to. 
I got you, Marilith. I know you're going into a very crazy and busy season, and I hope that it's not too bad this year, but I, I hope that it, it goes all right. So it's it's getting to that time of the year. Have a good night, Marilith. Thanks for being here. And also, Pikami, thank you for being here. Good night. And Rube, anybody else need to go to bed? I think this is the time. This, If you were waiting for a sign to try to get some sleep, this is it. <laughs> I will virtually tuck you in. Mwah. Have a good night to Rube and to everybody that needs to go get you some sleep. Uh, yes, a cell. So I have officially gotten two new monitor mounts that I needed. I bought the second um, Elgato light. I bought a 27 or 30 inch monitor. That's the one that's gonna be going vertical. Um, and then I have the camera and the mixer and a new desk. I literally like, this is going to be a very, very big change because it's also, oh, and I bought a new capture card again, just in case I'm going to try a different brand. Um, and I have to do all that plus the second PC. And so all of this is going to be changing. I was going to, it was supposed to be this month, but with me having to push out the time that I was going to do it, I was going to do it next week. Um, I think I can officially talk about this, but because uh, I accepted, but I'm going to be doing a stream takeover next week. So I'm going to be on somebody else's channel, streaming on somebody else's channel. I I'll talk more about it this weekend. Um, but basically it's, it it's a stream that I can't like put off or anything. Um, so now it's going to be afterwards. But yeah. <laughs> That's nice, HQ. Well, if you need to get some sleep. So. <laughs> so. <laughs> Claim to watch till you finish this level. I'm sorry. I will keep going then from King of Plants. Sorry. I got I got chatty, which I do so often, but I should at least be playing the game while I chatty. I just had missed so much. I wanted to make sure I didn't miss anything that time. Anything else here? Okay. Hello, rat. Don't eat me. Leave me alone. <laughs> Mr. Rat, stop it. <laughs> I know I'm part of the rat pack, but jeez, get out of here. <laughs> Did you know this chapter cards are not single use disposable? Yes. So there's a couple things to that. I still have the capture card that Xena helped me pay for. Um, and I need to try that one. But Elgato's been kind of a bitch lately <laughs> with the lack of the other ones working properly. So, like, this one seems to be 100% dead because it's having the crackling issue. The one that I have currently plugged in, I think, is the one that Watery sent me. This is the one that I've had for quite a few years now. So maybe that's just it. Um, and then I have the newer Elgato that I haven't tried using because it messed with my audio last time. But if I'm going to be changing a whole bunch of stuff, it won't matter if I have to change the audio again because I'm going to have to. <sighs> what I'm trying to say is there's going to be a lot of changes for the better. Um, there will be better lighting. There's going to be a better camera. Um, when my when frame rate drops in the game, my camera will no longer have frame rate drops because I'll be streaming on a second PC. Um, so like as far as quality improvements, you guys are going to see a very big shift. Ouch. In death from Laura. <laughs> Whoops. Let me restate that. You'll see a lot of good shifts, just not Laura deaths, hopefully. So I'm, I'm, I'm putting a lot into this. I, I mentioned it the other day. Thanks to Monkey Fluence for getting one of the mounts because that helped a lot. But I spent another five hundred dollars in upgrades for the PC or for the stream setup, so I won't be able to invest like that in the future, at least not for the time being, unless we start getting monetized on other platforms. But hopefully that'll be the last big changes we need because that's the camera quality is going up, the lighting quality is going up. The stream quality potential will be going up. This audio quality hopefully goes up with it as well. So. I did it again. I was not trying to walk off. Clearly, but.
Oh, I hit my head that time. Yeah. That's fair. If things didn't go smoothly, they wouldn't be streamer equipment. No kidding. I mean, I have plenty of things that do work well. This is not what they meant by when they said walk it off. <laughs> I keep bonking my head. All right, you know what? For the sake of everything, I'll save here real quick. <laughs> oh, goodness. Because I was trying to get to this ledge over here, but I don't even know if I need to. Okay, that time I didn't fuck it up. See, I think I was just supposed to drop. Yeah. But I think I can shoot the rats from here, so let me do that. There we go. And then we can just, like, shimmy. And then walk off. There we go. Perfect. That's what I wanted it to do, but controls. <laughs> Yay for CDU for Laura. <laughs> Lara needs a hard hat or at least a bump cap. <laughs> that she does. Okay, let me see real quick. Okay, this is just if you fell, I guess. All right. Oh, I know it wasn't Rob King of Plants, but you saying that just made me realize that I hadn't been moving for a while, so... No, 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 no. I, I didn't mean for it to come off that way. I'm sorry if it did. I just realized I hadn't really moved yet. Okay. So I have two keys. Oh, the water's up. That's what that switch did. So now I can go there. Those two are where these keys go. I'm assuming then I'll find something that allows me to go that way because that also looks like it needs a key. Yeah, get out of here. I'm, I'm over you guys. Where's, come here alligator. I'm not dealing with y'all. I also haven't explored underwater. I don't know if that leads somewhere down there. Where's that other rat? I know he's under me somewhere. There you are. There we go. Hey, e-bots. Remember when Electric Man was like, I'm not a bot, and then we renamed him Electric Bot in Discord for a long time. <laughs> oh. A secret. Good times. It's the little things that make me laugh and smile throughout the day. I don't... Is he still... I thought he changed, unless he changed it back. I don't think so. Maybe I'm crazy. Where are you, electric man? Oh, he is still electric bot. Never mind. Am I having a weird thing where... Oh. It's like I have a glitch in the matrix. For some reason, I thought he changed it back. Ah, whoops. I thought he could change it because he's a legend. Because uh, VIPs can change their name. And people I know are like, well, why can't we change our name? It's just an easier modding purpose for us. That's the only reason why I don't have people change their names. Because, like, I don't have my Discord set to, like, subs only or anything like that. Because I wanted it to be inclusive to everybody. But to help me and my moderation team. If we have a problem with somebody in Twitch, then we need to get rid of them in the Discord and vice versa. So, uh, I let all my mods, or sorry, not all my mods, all my uh, VIPs do it. But I thought Legends could change their name as well. But maybe I didn't let the Legends change their name, so I can't remember. Sorry, I was answering Rube's DM since he was going to bed. Um, sorry, I don't know why I thought you had. No, you didn't. It's still electric bot. I was apparently having a brain fart. Oh, 
Oh, I know which one you're talking about, Scarlet. Thanks for wording it that way. I knew exactly who you meant. Yep, I know exactly who you mean. Nice job. Good job on a beauty another boss. I would only ever change my name to Gabrielle 50. I'm kind of surprised that you don't have that since she's your favorite, but I understand having Xena is probably more even more recognizable. So <laughs> I think we'd know that's you. And the whole reason why I was okay with VIPs changing their names is obviously because they're trusted in the community. I would do it with subs, but we even have like some people get gifted subs kind of situation. And so like it's just, again, easier for moderation purposes, trying to make sure the community stays safe kind of situation. So we've had problems in the Discord before. Now that was years ago at this point. We've actually had a really easy time with Discord in general, but it's because we've implemented things to keep the community safe over the years. And that's definitely a primary goal to make sure it's a space that people feel safe and welcome in. Perfect electric man. I thought you could, so. Should have been electric, but okay, that would have been clever. And see, I I do hate that, like, I don't have everybody be able to change names because, like, seeing names and other people's. Oh, that bitch is here. Is the gorilla hitting him? I hope so. Yes, gorilla, do work! Get him, gorilla. I won't hit you or shoot you. Kill him. Kill him for me. No, I don't want to shoot the gorilla. I want to shoot the other guy. I'm saving right here. This is great. <laughs> I don't know if the gorilla is actually hitting him or not. It kind of sounded like he was, but... No, he's not. Damn it. Okay. Oh, I guess I already shot him enough. Nice. Oh, no, I did. He's still there. shooting it's okay also Xena random thought I had like yesterday that, like I said Xena's been super supportive and very sweet during my depressive era and I'm not saying this to say that people need to gift me things to make me feel better it was just that she had sent me some things like while I was having such a bad time and it just gave me a pick me up while it was happening um but Zena you're not allowed to get me a, a birthday gift because <laughs> uh, you've been far too too kind Oh, that's nice, Blaster. Xena does a whole bunch of like conventions and stuff, and has met uh, met the lovely ladies multiple times. It's it's always lovely to see the pictures. Xena also does cosplay when she goes. It's really cool. No, that's fair, Xena. And I mean, you, you keep whatever you want to. But hey, if you want to try out the Gabrielle fifty name in the Discord, you go for it. See how it feels on you. Three great apes walk into his sister. <laughs> yeah, that was the other guy was definitely a, a great. Okay, I'm saving again. Uh, great, great ape. Sorry, I feel like I'm playing very slow today, but this has been a nice game also to just kind of get back into the groove of things too. I made it. But wait, there looks like there was stuff there. Oh, hang on. But then I'm gonna have to do the jumps again, but that's okay. I think that's the right way to go. I was just really cool and figured out all the other stuff. Wait, what? Okay, she didn't re-grab. I expected her to re-grab. Uh, what happened? What happened for what duo? Sorry. I know I've said like five different things. Uh, welcome back, Colossus. Doesn't seem like the most accurate strategy. Fair. Oh, I appreciate the electric man. Yeah, nothing's ever expected. And like I said, I don't want that to come off like as a 
as a oh i should send things to cd and make her feel better <laughs> believe me gifts make me feel better but i don't want that to make it like seem like it's correlated if that makes sense Oh, it depends on the story. Xena was just being very sweet. I was going through kind of a depressing time the last few days prior to even election stuff, but just had kind of a rough last like four or five days mentally. So. <laughs> I'm still calling Xena it's shorter. That's fair. But you don't even say my name right. Estelle and it's two letters. <laughs> uh. Oh, that's nice, Zena. Well, I appreciate it. But no, you're not allowed to get me a birthday gift. Yay, that worked. Okay. Uh, those look like guns. Ooh! I pressed the wrong button. Oh, thank God that didn't kill me. Oh, that's sweet, Zena. I love that. They do say sometimes it's not good to meet your heroes, but that's not the case with everyone. Heroes are still just people that show up. <laughs> I'm just giving you crap to sell, but you know that. Birthday is coming up around the corner. But like I said, um, I, I don't need anything. Um, I, I'll be streaming for my birthday. I talked about the other day. And I hear a lion. Also, I'm feeling emotional about it again. So I'm actually not going to complete that statement because I'm still feeling very emotional. But I'll be here to celebrate with you guys. And it wasn't a lion, it was an alligator. Alligators. Th three alligators? Three alligators. Okay. Ooh. Yoink. Because I see another one. Oh, are you a December as well, Bob? And you're the 13th? I have another friend that's the 13th. You may or may not know them, but that would be Mr. Zero Period Productions is the 13th as well. So you share a birthday with Mr. George. I can easily remember Llama, George's, and Watery's. Because we're all right about the same. Llama's the day after mine. Uh, George is the week after Llama's. And Watery's is 10 days after mine on the 15th. And then Rubes is the 20th. My brother's is the 21st. There's a whole bunch of other birthdays in December. I'm just thinking of all the easy ones to remember. So it's pretty crazy. The big 4 -o. Nice. Well, I hope everybody that celebrates has a good time after all of that. And there's still a rat down here. Goodness. <laughs> to get the guns, indeed. Wait, was that a quick solution? I mean, it took me a lot longer unless you're just like poking fun at me. It took a while to get the guns. <laughs> I can promise you it's survivable. <laughs> oh, Lord have mercy. Oh, I have not tried... I have not tried using the magnums at all, unless that's literally the first time I took them up. I think they are, but... That's why there's ammo, though. That makes so much more sense. I had mentioned this at one point. I was like, why is the gun, if it's unlimited, why am I picking up ammo? And I realized I was picking up like Uzi clips at one point, but I still didn't understand why it looked like I was picking up pistol clips. But now that makes so much more sense. I probably shouldn't use them. I should probably keep them because there's probably going to be like bosses and stuff that I need them. For. Laura, you were supposed to jump. Oh, well. 
Oh, I love to hear that, Xena. I'm very glad. Your birthday is in December too, Electric Man? I don't know if I knew that. I know Pegasus is as well. Like I said, we have a lot of December birthdays. Like there is is a lot. Oh, Dangers is also in December as well. See, I'd forgotten hers. Yeah, there's a lot of December birthdays. No, Xena does not look sexy at all. Hell no. Xena is aging like a fine wine. Ugh, come on. I have good jeans. That's nice. Oh, really? Okay, gotcha, Rob King of Plants. I knew you weren't necessarily, like, touting or making fun at me. I just... I didn't know if that was actually, like, that was how I was supposed to do it or not. I'm going to save after every one of those short jumps, because the short jumps are hard on modern controls. That has a lever there. Yoink. And then... Yoink. Okay. I don't need to go over there, right? Okay, no, 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 that's where I came from. Sorry, I had a brain fart for a second. I guess I'm having a couple of those tonight. One thing I will confirm is that my birthday is in the next 12 months. That's true. I don't know if I know a cell's birthday. Now, that being said, if you all were to ask me every single person's birthday, there's no way I'm going to remember it. I had thought about adding a calendar thing to the Discord. Maybe I still will. I just never got around to adding it. Oh, look at that. I see the eyes. Oh, wait. Those are magnums. I probably shouldn't use the magnums on the rat. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <gasps> no! I try. Okay, well, it doesn't matter. I'll get my ammo back. <sighs> that was funny. Time to look up the definition <laughs> over again. <laughs> You'll see my name in there, Asel, <laughs> with magnums and rats. <laughs> <laughs> your half birthday's in December, sure. <laughs> Means my half birthday's in your uh, your month, Rob Go June. So have good jeans. I feel like I got good jeans too. As in, I bought some not too long ago. <sighs> For when you really want to get rid of the rats. <laughs> okay, so how do I do this without fucking up? <laughs> Okay, it's maybe I, I have to do the short jump maybe because the, the head is hitting that. I should have, did I save one more time there? I didn't, whoops, I should have. It's kind of complicated because my head keeps hitting the top so it's causing an issue where I am not jumping properly. Hi, Captain Casa, how are you doing today? Good to see you, I hope you're well. I don't know why contracting just made me think of it, but I'm finally wearing my contacts again. I had them out for over a week. It's probably the longest I've gone without my contacts in a really long time. Okay, new plan. I forgot I still had the magnums on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still getting eaten by these bitches. Okay, that just worked better than trying to jump across. Even though... Rat. But it's fine. Uh, I'm gonna second what Electric Man just said. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be a Friday the 13th of December? Very nice. I didn't even think of that. Even though I was talking to somebody yesterday about um, 
a, a co-stream together. It's going to be that coming weekend. Come here, alligator. I don't want to see you later. I want to see you now. supposed to yeah oh my god oh good lord I'm getting confused okay there's where to go up there I keep seeing keys behind places. Where does this lead? Just out of my curiosity. This leads all the way back here. Okay, that's good to know. So after you get the keys, then you can come back here again. And there's another key there. Laura, can you, can, can you go underwater? Laura, hello? There we go. I was like, why is it not doing that? Who designed these temples anyway? Oh, hey, there's a thing here. Before I get that. Duh, Cell. I should have gotten that joke. I totally should have gotten that joke. Damn it, that's highbrow. I love it. You could do something fun for that then. Bob does stuff for a Friday the 13th. I've never seen Princess Bride. I know that's a, a sin around here, but I have not seen it. Is the water gonna go up? No. Oh, maybe there was a... There probably was. Okay, hang on. I missed something then. Absolutely. I'm gonna be real honest with you. Princess Bride never appealed to me. Mainly because I got so tired of people talking about it. That I didn't really want to watch it. I watched part of it and didn't, like, I will say that. I watched part of it when I was younger and didn't care for what I watched. And then people always kept talking about it. I'm just like, I don't want to see it now. When something becomes so popular, it's just like, ugh. So now I'm just not watching out of spite. <laughs> mm. Absolutely. Lord of the Rings is better anyway. Thanks, Electric Man. Good night, Michael with two L's. Thanks for being here. I appreciate you. Yeah, Electric Man, I'm just, I'm just, I don't know, don't really care to watch it with, like, constant, like, people talking about it. <laughs> I'm, I, I, I will say it this way, Scarlet, I won't be the one asking people to watch it. We'll put it that way. I have no desire. You'd probably be shocked for me to ever ask that question. 
Where is the lever for this one? Maybe I have to lower the water somehow. And then it becomes a jumping puzzle. It's kind of what it looks like. Okay, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna save here. I'm gonna go down. I feel like I'm missing something there. It's probably obvious, but not to me right now. But that would make sense, because I have a key now. I'll go over here, and then I'll change the water level again to go through that area. So maybe that's what it is. Yeah, I think that is what it is. Okay. Maybe I'm still on the right path then. Oh wait, nope. It doesn't have a key, never mind. <sighs> See, I figured you would be able to go to that section and figure it out. Hang on, I wanna look over here at something. Cause I opened both of these. Oh, that was the way to get there. What was this way? Did I even go through here? I don't remember. Yeah, this led to the water that was there. Right, right, right. Oh, whoa, no it didn't. That spikes, what the hell? Never mind, this is different. That scared the crap out of me. Oh, there's a key. glad there's a big box for it to be able to center over. Okay. But that looks like a different color key for this, so I don't know if that's right. But we'll see. Oh, you can tell me it's your favorite movie. Just won't make me go and watch it any, any quicker. be using my new magnums but I was like I should save those for like boss fights or something <laughs> cabinet of Dr. Caligari Caligari a good silent movie it has been a long time since I watched a silent film but I have seen one before no no I knew it wasn't going to fit here because it wasn't the same color. I have no idea where the gold key goes, though. I don't remember seeing another door. Pfft. Fair, Robco. Fair. <laughs> fair. Very, very fair statement. I like Laura's no, too. It's very firm. No. Okay, let me double check my logic here. That's where I came from. We came out there at one point. Yes, because we went up there. We came out the bottom of that. That's the direction we need to go. We have one gold key. That one area that I'm unsure of. I must be doing something wrong in that area. Because I didn't see a lever, but maybe I just missed it. Nosferatu. Oops. I missed it. Yeah, the game is just making sure you know that's not the right thing. Hmm. 
Yoink. Here we go. Now I'm back here. Maybe there wasn't a door that required it, right? No, because I came down here. All the damn alligators. I could. I don't remember what lever raised or lowered the water. Maybe I'm supposed to do that again? That seems kind of roundabout, but I don't remember where that was. It seems like a weird level design for that to do that, though. So it's probably wrong. Here we go. I'm just mumbling, <laughs> Zena. In this case, I'm literally just mumbling to myself. I am doing the mumbles, trying to figure out what I want to do here. Ugh. This is what happens whenever I'm not on stream. <laughs> Has anyone seen my lurk? <laughs> I think I dropped it somewhere. Hi, LT. How are you doing? It's good to see you. Yeah, no, in this case, I'm just mumbling to myself and being like, eh, go here. Nah, nah, nah. That's something I'll actually have to be better about doing when I think it'll be fine. So obviously I've talked about this a lot is that I'm going to be making <laughs> exclusive YouTube content as well. And I've never quite done something like that before where it's you know ju just me the camera and the game kind of situation so I hope that they come off well obviously I thrive a lot with interaction with people and I don't know if I'm entertaining enough just on my own I guess we'll find out when I start making those what am I missing well, I know what I'm missing this door opens with uh, lever, but I can't get up here. It doesn't let me up here. This is too tall. This is me back to mumbling. <laughs> yeah, actually, it's funny you mentioned that, uh, Zena. I don't know if I, I don't know if you were here during the conversation, um, but when I announced full-time content creation, I actually talked to Lilia. She reached out and we chit-chatted for like four hours. <laughs> We were on a call together for like four hours. It was funny because like it was the first time that her and I had actually like spoken like verbally um, to each other, which was funny because I mean, we've known each other for over four years now at this point. Uh, but yeah, we, we just talked and talked and talked and she gave really, really great advice. Lily is wonderful and I appreciate her friendship and everything. So she she gave me some advice, some things to avoid, some things that are like good for, for the growth of the channel and all sorts of stuff. I just haven't gotten to put almost anything into action yet because of, well, life got in the way of a lot of big goals. And then I've really been focusing on the streaming because of the plus program thing. Cause it would suck for me to be like, hey guys, like, going for a plus program but I'm gonna stream less like that seemed like such a terrible thing to do so since that was going well I decided to focus on that but the video stuff has to happen like to maintain being a full-time content creator I have to find another revenue source and that's obviously the best one so so shorts videos all that stuff is currently being worked on um, and I hope to start actually giving you all that very soon definitely is one of those things you don't know until you try yeah I'm gonna be honest with you all though part of it like I put off because I know that streaming's importance and is like is still gonna be the primary thing I do first and foremost if anybody is like Oh, are you going to completely change your format and stuff? No. Um, I still plan on doing streaming as the first and YouTube as the residual start bringing people in who may not know about the channel or whatever. Um, just another discoverability tool and obviously another uh, revenue source. But then also, like, I, I'm still going to be streaming as the number one for me. So... But yeah, 
Lilia definitely helped me a lot. And uh, she has followed up with me, actually. Um, <laughs> we, we haven't figured out something just yet, but we do plan on doing something together in the future. So... I'm telling you, I've been talking with a lot of people and doing a lot of stuff in the background. A lot of things you all haven't been quite privy to yet, but I'm very excited to share a lot of fun stuff coming in the future that I think you all will really enjoy. Or at least I'm hoping you all will really enjoy. Ah, see, I think this is what I was supposed to do, even though it seemed a little backtracky, but... And then we come up here, and then it becomes jump puzzle. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, no, I can't actually get up here. What? Do I have to come from the other way? Is it even possible to come from the other way? Am I completely misunderstanding this? We'll see. Yeah, I'm not 100%. Well, I, I kind of have an idea of what I'm planning on doing, Glass Joe. Um, one thing that people will probably be like, oh, Lord, is that the... YouTube side of things is going to be split into multiple channels and some people will be like oh brother because that seems to be like a common thread but if you know anything about YouTube and the algorithms and stuff it's that it can fuck fuck up a lot of stuff and Lilia has had this happen to her um, as well and so one thing her and I talked like discussed quite a bit about was was how that was going to look and so obviously I haven't been pushing my YouTube stuff because I still haven't really created a whole lot. Ugh, I can't see. But uh, there is going to be two different channels that focus on different things. So instead of... Because Pure Variety already suffers in some instances on, on Twitch, but it's even worse on YouTube. So... Yeah, no, the editing will take way more than even half the time a cell. The uh, the George Bob video that I did, which was all cut up shorts or like clips that I just spliced together and then did a little bit in the beginning and a little bit of editing at the end, took like nine hours for a 30 minute video that was already recorded. So now granted, that was me having never done any editing whatsoever. And so clearly I didn't know how to use the software and a lot of stuff, but um, yeah, I've got a, I got a long road ahead of me. So yeah. But yeah, I haven't even mentioned that I have a, I've already created the second YouTube channel. Just nobody knows about it yet. Actually, if anybody was like super observant, they would actually already know that it exists because it has for two months now, I think. <laughs> but I just didn't say it out loud or tell people that it existed, but it's already been there and it's been there for a little while now. Yeah, the floating animals because of the water like went down. Yeah, there's yeah, there's a lot of different stuff, Glass Joe. There's a lot of nuances. And obviously I haven't just gotten advice from one person. Lilia had really, really great advice. Again, both on what to do and what not to do, because like she's she talked about like some of the things that she wished she could have done differently and so advised on maybe a potential better course of action. And she's not the only one. I actually had multiple people reach out. George as well has talked a bit about it to me and we'll talk more once I actually get to really putting content out there. But yeah. So technically there's already two YouTube channels, but um, one of them doesn't have anything on it yet because I haven't recorded anything for it yet. But yeah. There you go, Biv. How are you doing? Is this better for you? <laughs> I think I might actually be on the right path. Maybe I thought correctly, unless this is just a wild goose chase. And if it is, then so be it. <laughs> it's not like I can't go back and change how I'm doing this. Yeah, because I never took this path. So actually, this might be correct. <laughs> they recognize it a little better there, Biv. 
<laughs> oh, oh, thank God. That one's closer, so go there. Boop. And then that leads to the... That's not the way I want to go. That's the way I want to go, right? Again, I don't even know if this is right. Maybe this is all wrong and I'm just doing something like ridiculous at this point that is not even a thing. But sorry, CD, I've not been stalking you across various media platforms, which is fine, Acel. There's actually only one place, two places that it's listed right now. So I would have been shocked if somebody had found it at this point, truly. Because there's nothing on it yet. I just went and grabbed the domain name. One of the channels is CD Plays. One of the channels is CD Adventure. So. But I haven't posted anything on the other one. But they are going to have different types of content on them. As far as what the gameplays will. Or what the uh, channels will offer. So then people, if they want more cd content then um that's where they'll be able to find it cd cd venture cd venture side venture unfortunately cd gaming was already taken which is funny because that's what i remapped all of my social medias to pretty much except for anything that had just cd which it's it's hard to get a four-letter name pretty much anywhere so <laughs> no CD Sims. No, that's not going to happen. Although it's crazy to me how many, like, how, like, a lot of people do Sims channels and it works really well. Yeah, it sucks, duo. So CD Gaming, as in the YouTube channel, has nothing to do with CD Gaming anywhere else. And the only other places that I couldn't get the name is fucking Twitter, which I don't plan on using that platform pretty much. Unless I absolutely have to for sponsorships, so. But yeah, CD Gaming, I've literally rebranded my name everywhere else. Unless it's just CD, which is on Twitch and, like, my affiliate links and stuff. But everywhere else, um, Threads, Blue Sky. I did get it on Blue Sky already. Um, Threads, Blue Sky, Instagram, TikTok, everything else is CD Gaming now. So whenever I talk about there's a lot of stuff that I'm working on in the background, like, there is a lot of stuff that I'm I'm doing uh, in the background that it may not matter to you all because you don't need to worry about my socials if you don't want to follow them or if you don't use that platform or whatever. Uh, but yeah, I, uh, I've been working on all sorts of random stuff. But to go back to do, do uh, excuse me, good lord, Duo's question. Uh, I haven't done a whole lot on YouTube yet, and I also haven't started. I haven't posted shorts yet. I did work on some of them, and so I actually have some to post. I just haven't done it yet. Um, and part of that's because I wanted to consistently have enough to post regularly. So I've just been kind of waiting until I have more. And the other reason is I'm scared. <laughs> so I'll have to get it. I'll have to rip the bandit off at some point. So it's funny, Blaster. A lot of people, well, quite a few people will type CD that way, which is fine. Buy out the name, just don't offer more than $1.75. I'm good. I couldn't even get CD90 on Twitter because it was a banned, blocked account and it had been banned for over three years and I asked them to repeal it and that I could take over that name and they wouldn't let me. I wasn't cool enough or big enough, but that's that was Twitter even before the bullshit days. Um, but yeah, fuck Twitter now. I used to love it. I've never been a social media person and most people know that. It took me, what, two, three months to post my Vegas trip pictures? Oh, ads are here. <laughs> Hang on, I'm going to jump to this real quick and then I'll stop moving for a second yay well I figured it out I'm proud of myself for figuring that out but um ugh, I love that they give you a compass I've never even once opened it or looked at it 
Um, but I'm, I'm not a social media person, which is bad for me as a content creator and advertising myself. It's so funny because I talk about how I can advertise like everything else in the world except for myself because I just don't like to. What's your MySpace? If it still exists, which I... I can't imagine it does. I think it was Crazy CD Girl. I'm assuming it doesn't exist. Even my old Yahoo got deleted. I know MySpace still exists. I meant like my page on MySpace, uh, SL. Because like even my Yahoo account got deleted at one point, which is funny because I didn't log in for like three years or something. Because they used to have a Yahoo and a Hotmail account. But my Yahoo account, I just didn't log into anymore because it got, like, ridiculously spammed. And so I just stopped using it. Snag the GeoCities and Angel Fire page? I don't even know what either of those are, LT. I have no idea. Oh, you guys want to hear a fun fact? My Reddit account got banned. <laughs> I've been on Reddit for like 11, 13 years. I use it just to look at memes and cute cat pictures and stuff. But um, I, uh, I was accessing it in one moment. Bob does stuff. Wait, tier three for, okay. I'm, I'm assuming, wait, resubscribed. Does that mean you did three months in advance or is this like in the middle of the three months? I keep having issues with this because the way they word it in Twitch activity feed it confuses me now. So like I never understand it. But Bob, thank you so much for the tier one for three months. I appreciate that. And thank you for subscribing for two months total. Thank you. Thank you. Unfortunately, many never delete your data. Yeah, that's very true, Biv. But thank you so much. <laughs> Scarlet. Oh, well, thank you so much. I appreciate that. Obviously, I appreciate it regardless of how long it was. Just I, I get confused because of the way that it's written in the activity feed. Well, thank you. Enjoy your emotes and ad previewing for 90 days then. I appreciate that. There, now we're back from ads. But uh, my, my Reddit got banned. Um, I've been on the platform for 13 years. And again, I just used it to look at cute cat pictures and get some dank memes and, and look at some random stuff. Like, uh, just, it was browsing. I never really posted on I don't think I ever posted on it or even commented on it for that matter. Regardless, um, I don't know what happened, uh, but I got an email one day that said that there was suspicious activity on my account. And I was like, the only thing I could think of is that I'd been in the UK and I opened and I browsed Reddit when I was in the UK when I'm normally not in the UK because uh, I got the email shortly after that. But I didn't get any notifications other than that. The problem is that I made my account so long ago as the old Reddit and you didn't have to have an email to log in. So I have no way to recover it. And so they're like, yeah, it's basically just permanently banned because I have no way to recover it. Now, their support team told me that I could go. Now, I say their support team. It was an automatic. It, this is important. It was an automatic uh, email it was like, oh, if you can still log in, then you can add an email address to your account. And I was like, oh, I can still log in. My password and everything still works fine. So I can log in to Reddit. Um, but it wouldn't let me add an email address. Like it doesn't let me. And I'm like, so was that a lie? Like what's going on? Like you guys told me I can add an email address, but it's not working. Cause I was going to reset my passwords and stuff. Cause that's all they said I needed to do to get unbanned. Um, and it didn't work. So I tried emailing them. No answer. I tried emailing them again. No answer. I emailed them three times in the matter of 10 days, obviously giving enough time for a potential response. And I never received a single email from like a legit person. 
I received one automated email when I got banned and that told me what I could try to do to recover it. So my account is still banned. Technically I can log into it, but because it's banned, it has a lovely little you are banned red banner all over the place. And I can't do anything except for just look at posts. So, so yeah, my account got banned on Reddit for no reason at all. <laughs> but yeah, so based on Reddit, people in Arkansas don't travel. Apparently, they said it was suspicious activity because I I can kind of understand it, Glass Joe, because I may not have like browsed it. And I the interesting thing is I've definitely browsed it like when I traveled like a whole bunch across the U.S. But it wasn't until it was in a different country that they're like, oh, hell no, even though I'd been thousands of miles away from home and browsed before. But yeah, yeah, exactly. A cell. So yeah, because my original account did not have a email attached to it, there's no way to recover it. Yeah. Anyway, so that's my my Reddit story. So my account, if anybody tries to find my account on Reddit, it's it's been blocked and banned. I'm a durable person. But yeah. So ooh, yay, water. <laughs> oh no! No, 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 no. Cause I have to go all the way back around. Fuck that. Nope. Fuck that. Oh, thank Jesus. I made a save right here. Yay for the water, but I need the key first. Okay, very... Boop. Okay, that's fine. There we go. Okay, we're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. There we go. See, I figured it out. I'm glad I figured out the puzzle, though. Oh, yeah. Exactly, Rob. God, fuck off, dude. No, fuck you. I'm getting out of here. <laughs> no, I'm very like particular in the subreddits that I'm in and stuff, Rob Coke, because Reddit can be a super helpful tool, but it also can be a site full of terrible people, just like anywhere else on the internet. So it just depends on how restrictive you are about what you want to see and listen to and et cetera. So. Reddit has a lot of how-tos, and I have utilized its, its valuable information multiple times. Ooh. Do you want to play her fight right now, Scarlet? Sounds good, Bob. Thanks for being here. Oh, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. I, I really appreciate that. Like I said, I had some wonderful people reach out to me. I've had a couple people reach out specifically about YouTube stuff. I've had a couple people reach out that's like, hey, if you need help with editing stuff, let me know. And then I've also had some very random, wonderful people reach out about a whole bunch of other stuff. Um, some, some names that kind of surprised me. Um, I don't remember, shit, where did I go to raise the water? That's where I went to raise the water and lower the water last time. Because I need to raise the water so I can reach that. Right, 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 right. But yeah, so I've had people reach out for all sorts of things. So I have a very good network of people to rely on, which is very, very wonderful. I agree, Xena. Like, I, I've used Reddit for a lot of, like, mishaps or, like, troubleshooting and stuff. Again, the website is good and bad, just like every other social media website. There is shit, and there's also great stuff, and it's muddling through the shit and making sure that you don't see that kind of stuff. But, like, you just got to figure out where you want to go on the platform. That makes sense, last time. Okay, that's fine, Scarlet. Then I can watch you do it later. I appreciate it. You do whatever you want. If you do decide you want to fight her some, let me know. I'll just bring it up on my side. 
No more alligators, right? <laughs> I saw the alligator right there. I was like, oh, fuck. <laughs> Did you get anyone come forward offering you to play Ray Shadow Legends? Asel, I've been getting offers to play Ray Shadow Legends since I had like 100 followers. <laughs> let, me, let me see real quick. Hang on. Uh, let me look at something real fast. One second. I don't have one right now, though. I don't have one right now. Uh, I am going to be taking another opportunity, but that's... I, I won't talk about that right now. Uh, I've always mentioned that I will only ever take stuff as long as I can afford to live, right? If I needed to do something to make money, like then that's different. But uh, I will always stick to my guns the best I can when I say that I want to just stream what I think I will enjoy and what the community will enjoy. Um, but I have Factor and HelloFresh because, my God, the amount of offers I've gotten from those two over the years. <sighs> Monopoly Go, Roblox, Uno Mobile, Genshin Impact, Merge Studio Fashion Makeover, Animals and Coins, Dice Dreams, Domino Dreams, Hero Land. The fuck is Hero Land? Candy Crush Saga. Game of Thrones Winter is coming. Tiki Tiki Solitaire Tri Peaks. I actually probably would like that. <laughs> Star Trek Fleet Commander. Oh, and even has a base. That's nice. Watcher of Realms. Zenless Zone Zero. Marvel Strike Force. Royal Match. You'll notice by some of the names, a lot of those are mobile. And I just don't mobile game. So I've, I will almost probably never accept a mobile one. I can't even imagine that I would. Um, unless it was for something I enjoyed. And then there are a couple for PC, but... Again, those aren't anything that really interests me. So I could do that, but... <sighs> Alas, I try to only take stuff that's good. I There probably isn't one for me, Bob, because I declined it so much and said that I don't want to see it anymore that <laughs> they probably stopped. <laughs> I'm not even joking. Uh, Stream Elements has a thing where you can say you don't want access to something, and I've done that. So, so there probably is a Raid Shadow Legends one, one going right now, but I can't see it because I've declined it. Hi, Elvis. How are you doing? I'm doing well, thank you. How are you? Oh, Honey. I remember Honey, NordVPN. There's a bunch that are like the big ones that people always hear about. Oh, yeah, for sure, Estelle. No, you're fine. No, like I said, I will try to stick to my guns the best I can. The only time I would ever take a sponsorship that I truly wouldn't necessarily support on my own is if I, like, need to live. <laughs> if that's the best way to put it. And then at that point, I probably should be <laughs> not a full-time content creator anymore. So I'm going to try my best to only ever, ever take things that I want to play and that I think the community and myself will enjoy. So, like, Dying Light 2 was very fun. I'll, I'll be honest, part of my... <laughs> sometimes when I get too deep, people start, like, being a little, like, eh, so I don't talk about it a lot, but part of my depression came from... There was a couple of opportunities recently, stream-wise, that I got, like, snubbed on, or that people made me feel like my time wasn't worth worth it or something along those lines. I don't know how to best explain it without going into big details, so I, I won't, but it, it definitely made me feel very devalued. I never played Candy Crush. I actually... I, I really know nothing about it other than a lot of people played it.
So Lollip, who raided earlier, she actually plays a lot of Raid Shadow Legends. Like she actually has like a full guild and everything for it. And it was funny because she's like, haha, I know the memes. And I, for some reason, I remember this very well. I was playing the Alice in Wonderland um, update for Power Wash Sim. And I was watching her play and stream. And she was talking about Rage Shadow Legends and how she had all these heroes and stuff. And I was like, wow, somebody who like actually genuinely plays it. It was kind of funny to me. Okay, I don't know if there's... I'm going to save real quick because there was two lions. I know I did a lot of damage to the other one, but I like the level that... The fuck? Who gave the lion a Red Bull? Because that bitch had wings. Anyway, I was about to say I like the level, but I was very... <laughs> yeah, you know, Robka, we do what we do. I appreciate it. Thank you. But yeah, no, had some, some stuff come up that kind of just deflated me a little. Hi, another nerd. How are you doing today? It's good to see you. Who <laughs> want to rethink your liking of this level? Yeah, the lion didn't kill me, so it's fine. This looks like a boss room. Oh, that almost got me. It scared me. Hang on. Let's just get rid of those. Any others I need to get rid of? I see you, bitch. That that is definitely another lion. Look at those teeth. Wait, oh you can't see it. Okay, good. I don't know anyone that plays that game. That was Lollop was one of the first. And like she legitimately really enjoyed it, so. <laughs> me, I gave him a Red Bull. <laughs> I was about to say, can you give me one instead? But I'm like, no, I don't I don't drink energy drinks anyway. <laughs> I mean, clearly people play Raid or it wouldn't still exist. So. It's a chimera and it is fancy. Wait, I'm so confused. What? Wait, what? Okay, that's going to release the lion and then I need to go out the back maybe? But I want to see what's over there. So hang on. We're going to save. We're going to trigger this, which is going to make the lion upset. And then... Oh, a lot of lions. Uh-oh. 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 Get up. How'd you get that much damage on me? Again, I could be using the magnums, but... Where are they going? I got one down. Got two down. We're gonna have a flying lion again here in a minute. I wanted to see what was in here. Oh. There's another thing. I guess I needed to come in here. I... What? Wait, what? Did I need to push that thing all the way over here? But what was the thing for falling down then? Also, why would I need... Oh, close the door! Close the door! Close the door! Maybe you can like debate them and then come in here? I don't know that I understand it. <laughs> it looks like once I fall down, I can't do anything else, so. Come on, there we go, we're good. <laughs> yeah, I know we've talked energy drinks in here before and 
excuse me i've never drank a full can of like an energy drink in my life i tried one of the red bull energy shots uh once and it gave me the hardest crash i've ever had in my life and scared me and i've never drank something like that again so <laughs> the ford and nokia engage back in the day that's funny all of us you drink Red Bull for taste. I know it sounds like they would defeat the whole purpose. <laughs> but I wish they came out with a caffeine-free version. Oh, does Red Bull not? I know, like, Monster and stuff all have have them. Hi, Celestria. How are you doing? I felt like coming up here was better Side than dropping Gia. down. Also, hi, Chris Tractions. How are you doing? I'll read your message here in just a second. Welcome in. How are you? Celestria, thank you for the 29 month resub. How are you doing today? Good to see you. Yeah, Chris, I, I appreciate that. Thank you. Yeah, I, I have definitely developed depression over the last few years, and some weeks are just much harder than others. And, um, I don't know, like four or five days ago, I just got into a very bad mental rut. And I, I'm through the worst of it now. But there were a couple things that were getting me down. The stream video keeps pausing. Is anybody else having an issue? Uh, just in case, I want to make sure if anybody else is having an issue. But Chris, thanks for, for the kind words. It I, I'm through the worst of it now, I think. But uh, just something I have to kind of deal with from time to time. And this last week was, was just a rough one. It was a lot of feeling like I wasn't worth it kind of thing. But thank you. So, Lestrea, how are you doing? Tired, not sure what else beyond that. That's that's fair. I hope you can get some good sleep, so I have, I I understand that feeling. The last few nights I went to bed at 7 a.m. both nights. I literally stayed up overnight both nights. Found another tree spirit bitch, so that's three. Okay. I only remembered two. Unless there was two in that one area, then it might be three. Tree spirit bitches. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. It's it's rude to call CD a tree spirit. I mean, is she wrong though? that for you guys to decide i didn't mean to roll there i actually meant to do something else but see it was worth coming up here first because there was loot i knew if i dropped down then i figured i would be like gone so i felt like going up i could come back if i wanted to i thought that was that was you chris that was more formal in this instance just in case it wasn't but fair enough. Congrats on the name change. We were actually talking about name changes earlier. No, oh, that's adorable, Robco. Yoink. Here we go. Okay, now I should be able to drop down. Save. <laughs> wow okay that did not seem like i i completed a level that seemed like way worse <laughs> what was with that <sighs> oh god yeah, that's super verbiv. I, I don't go for or against it. I'm like, everybody do their research, do your own thing. You have one body, take care of it. But I say that and I am very chunky and need to lose weight. So, yeah. I appreciate it, Chris. Thank you very much. I, I did say that I have a lot of I have a lot of outlets that I can talk to. But whenever I'm in those moods, it's best if I don't talk to people. So... I know, I was really confused, Colossus. I was like, wait a second, like, the scream made me think like I did something wrong. 
Oh, that was really funny. Oh god, I can't see. I couldn't turn my camera. I did it! I beat the cisterns! That was a fun level. I liked it. It was a little weird to have to go all the way back around to get rid of the water. I felt like that was kind of a weird design choice, especially for the second key. Hello. I apparently can't pull this. I should have saved right before this. Oh shit, here's a... Uh oh. I am probably dead. Unless the water- oh thank god. Woo, that was close. I didn't, Dean. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't. I thought I was going to, but I didn't. <laughs> now we're gonna save. <laughs> I keep forgetting that it doesn't auto save between levels. So. There we go. Oi! That was terrible. I took so much death. Okay. We got blocks. Is this a movable block? It kind of looked like it was. Yung. <laughs> the outlets don't really talk back to me, but they do keep the lights on. <laughs> I like that solo story. No, it's fine. I read I read Chris's thing, Celestria, so it made me laugh. Absolutely, Olvis. A hundred percent. So I have a, a great support network, so I I'm fortunate in that instance, just Ow! What the heck? Ah I'm dead. <laughs> Maybe that's what I should do. Every time I die, I change it between the old- ah, I forgot the alligator was there! Fuck me! Jerk. I actually took less damage that time, so it's fine. <laughs> the ragdoll physics are hilarious. We had a really funny death earlier, Celestrea, where I'd killed a lion down below like way earlier on and then I died from fall damage and I landed right in its mouth. It was really funny looking. Okay. Oh. For the record, she did not jump. <laughs> Okay, there we go. Oh. <laughs> okay, that time was totally my fault. That was terrible. <laughs> and this is why I saved. <laughs> Got that Peter Griffin death but She does. That's funny, Pogo. Also, hi, Pogo. How are you doing? Okay. Yep. Stop moving. Okay. Okay. Where did those things come from? That's a great focus of Laura's ass. Nice. Okay. I see it there. Um. Oh, God. Ooh, I don't know how I didn't get hit. I don't know how I didn't get hit. Ugh. I just went for it hoping I wouldn't get hit. Is that gonna bring the water all the way up? No. There must be some place I can... I am 100% saving that one. The power of ass. 
Yeah, that was the focus mode, so it like put it right there. Sure, blame the pro tag. <laughs> I am for some of the jump, Xena. If you'd have seen earlier, there was like a jump I was trying to make and you could almost, I'm pretty sure the mic picked it up, but I was like spam pressing the button so you could actually hear the clicking sound and it was not jumping and it was driving me nuts. But according to Rob King of Plants, apparently there is like this slight input thing where it depends on if you're moving already like a certain you have to step a certain amount to get it to trigger and so i was having that problem but yeah i appreciate that chris well thank you for coming by but yeah if anybody needs to head out or i, I i've already been streaming for four and a half hours i didn't even realize it um like, if anybody needs to do anything, obviously, please take care of yourselves, take care of your business, do do all the things, whatever you need. I'll just be here. Oh, that made the thing float. Okay. Which means I don't actually need to go this direction, and I need to use that as a thing. There we go. Cool. All right. I like that. Dunk. 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 More saving, so much saving, such wow. Very savvy, well played. Oh, I feel like that was a lot of luck to be honest with you, but thank you. Another lever, lever. I do chain interchange those words a lot. The way I pronounce it a lot. Do -do -do, bad -do -do. Ooh, I am swimming quick. I feel like that was a secret back there at one point. I'm swimming hella quick. That was fun. Not rats. Rats are not fun. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I'm having a lot of fun with Team Raider. I, you guys know that I like, well, I like platforming. I like action adventure and I like um, puzzle stuff. So I'm having a lot of fun with this game because it kind of scratches all the all the itches that I like. Uh, let me go back here. Junk. Junk. And up. Uppies. I don't know why I think of that every time now. <laughs> oh, nailed it. I am so glad I didn't jump for that thing. That was that was ridiculous. So Hi Soches. Am I saying that correctly? I haven't even said hi, but I should head out. It's three AM and I don't don't know how I ended up here. Well it was probably Lollop's stream. I think that's our only no no no, Lollop and Dimples. Uh, both raided this evening, so it was either Lollop or Dimples. But so just thanks for at least saying hi, and I hope you have a wonderful night. Sleep well. Take care, Chris. Okay, I want that, but... It, like, goes at a weird angle. I'm going for this. I don't remember if I saved, so I'm saving again! Ballistic saving. It worked. I was like, is this going to hit me when I try to pick it up? I got it, Zeta. I got it. I've been saving like crazy, but. Oh, okay. Well, then chances are somebody raided into somebody else, and then you just ended up over here. But fair enough. <laughs> well, I hope you can get some more sleep then, especially if it sounds like you just woke up. 3 a.m. is a... Uh an early time to wake up. Actually, I'm gonna... Oh, for the love of God! I was about to save, too. You dick. I was literally about to save before trying to make that jump and that jerk comes out of nowhere. Come here. Nope, that's too far. 
This is weird when I don't have an edge. There we go. Uppies. Bum, 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 bum. You've updated your quest. All such as thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. <laughs> I I do appreciate it. I hope you get some good sleep. And I'm not on always this late, so I feel like sometimes people are like, oh, I don't want to stick around here because I'll never be, you know, watching Twitch at 3 a.m. I stream at different times throughout the week, so it makes it a little easier for people from ah, different places around the world to watch. But thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. I hope you have a wonderful night's rest. And hopefully we'll see you back sometime whenever it's not 3 a.m. It's probably, oh wait, oh dang it. And then I saved when I was down here. So I was down here anyway. God damn it. <laughs> Sorry. Fuck. <laughs> Ugh. Okay, I'm saving again when I'm back up there. Ballistic saving. <laughs> so I just loaded the save that I was still down there. But I have my health back, so. Wait, does that mean this? No, because he already showed up the one time. Okay. This is a weird jump. I don't know how. I don't know which jump this is. I think it's the this one. Oh, but I went the wrong direction. Ah, damn it. I was going to reload it <laughs> quicker than I could land, but I messed up. Well, I hope you get some good sleep, Electric Man. There we go. It's the short jump. Alright, what? Sir, sir, sir. I was trying to shoot, but it wasn't working, and... Where's my magnums? What? Why did he shoot again? <laughs> you dick. I got an achievement for that. <laughs> What was the achievement for? I didn't even see. Make Pierre go away using magnums. Au revoir. Only 8% of people have that achievement. I was tired of dealing with his shit, so... I have plenty of med kits, so it can be a little bit more... Oh wait, I died, so we're gonna switch back to that anyway. Screw you, Pierre. If my memory is fading and the next time I don't remember following, please remind me. <laughs> we'll do so, cheese. Oh my god, the penguin emote. Hell yeah. You seem like a lovely individual. Okay. What is this Sen's Fortress bullshit that I'm getting into right now? What is this? I have the magnums out right now. <laughs> Jesus. Freaking alligators, traps, lots of traps, lots of different traps. This is literally the sun's fortress. Okay, there's too much stuff here. There's a reason for this. You don't just give me things, game. I know that. All right, something's gonna, something's gonna get me. No mimics, we promise. I don't believe that. Don't know who Pierre is, but that dude. <laughs> That's the Duke that keeps following me and trying to shoot me and kill me, even though I'm just trying to do my job, man. Wait, I'm confused. What? I just got stuff. But there's no water in here. Was I supposed to hit the water switch again? I don't even remember where the water switch is. Oh lord. All my homies hate Pierre. Is that the I got all the way up here and I needed to have the water up. But now I don't remember where the water thing was, so... Oh no, oh thank god. I don't... I don't remember where the water thing is. Oh, I probably... wait. Where was the... Can I... I can't go back. 
Wait, no. I'm missing something then. I'm clearly missing something. Shoot. I don't think I saved whenever I went in there, so... What? Where am I missing something? Hmm. Well, shit. I missed something. Uppies! Uppies! <laughs> I'm so sorry. That's probably annoying, but it's all I can think about every time I do it. Oh, there's a... But I don't think I can make that jump from that angle? Maybe I can. Okay, eh. I'm gonna try. I think I can make it. I think that's the game. I think I can make it the game. <laughs> Is what this feels like. Oh no, so close. Get a long running head start. Yes! Okay, this is what I missed. Hmm? Oh. Can I like- Yeah, no it didn't! It didn't grab the ledge! That was not my fault. I tried. Great, now I gotta do this again. Oh, okay, good. I'm saving. It didn't grab the ledge. Now this is a problem with modern controls because you don't have the back step. So like you, I'm holding the right trigger is what you're supposed to do and kind of fall off, but it's not, it's a lot easier said than, said than done. We didn't even change the last time. Okay, how is the best way to do this? How do I like... I wish there was like a... There, like that's what it was supposed to do, but it's like really picky how to do that. And it doesn't work consistently. Like I was hoping just holding right trigger and trying to walk off would have that effect, but it doesn't always do it. I will pass through it, just not in a good way, Biv. There's a switch. <laughs> Obviously doing a 360 worked, you right? You have to do a 360 to walk off the edge. Okay, hang on. Okay, now there's water down there, so how do I... There. See, I got it to work that time. I don't even think I needed to this time, because... See, why is that working now flawlessly? <laughs> It worked flawlessly twice. And we can just drop. And then this is new right here. Wait, what? What? Why? Why did I have to get close to it to aim at it? Also, I was still in the magnums, but that's fine. Trying to keep my eye out for secrets. Spikes. I was like, what the fuck is that? And then it growled. It's another gorilla. Why are there just a bunch of animals always trying to kill me? Who feeds these? Th oh, that's a lion. Who feeds these guys? Maybe that's why they want to kill me so bad. They're hungry. But at the same time, what? Why are you here in the first place? Are, are you not hitting? It's Laura, there's clearly a monkey up there. Because I did the 360. It's so weird. It's like trying to walk off 
Like you need to walk off, but you're like trying to, I don't know. It's, it's weird on the modern controls. I do agree <laughs> that that part is weird. So. Yes, I knew you were there. You jerks. I saw you. Lara just wasn't shooting you for whatever reason. That's a keyhole. And stuff. Hi. I don't actually need the magnums because I can see you all without getting hurt. Are they throwing peanuts at you? I hope it's peanuts and not poop. Hey, come here. That one's dead. Okay, fine. Ugh. Okay, that was one of the times where I tried jumping and it didn't take the input because I apparently didn't step enough. Oh, I was kind of trying to do the side where he wasn't going to get me. Pierre. It was all Pierre's fault. That's what it is, Biv. Like I said, all my homies don't like Pierre. What? 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 Why? <laughs> Uh-huh. It's fine. I am good at video games. God damn it. <laughs> I think he's dead, though. We're fine. Okay, there we go. He's dead, so I don't have to worry about it anymore. And there's nothing even up here. Oh, you probably have to go through here after you... Okay. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Let's go this way first. But this makes it look like I needed something before going here yet. There's something. Oh, there's like a med kit or something down there. Mm, that was close. You know what? I will save, Biv. You right. <laughs> I've been saving so much, but I can save even more. <laughs> uh. Oh, that's my empty shells injecting. <laughs> fair, Zeta, fair. Yeah, because I can't reach this unless those are up, and I need a key first, so... You know, usually I hate swimming levels. This at least hasn't been that bad. Like, I thought I was going to hate it, like, so much more. I don't even know if I can get through that. Uh-oh. I know the spikes are there, but... There's nothing I can do. I just have to try to... Oh. I just have to try to make it... The, uh, the spikes are brutal. Yoink. Yoinkus. Shoot, okay, you need a, I think you need a short jump there. I think you need uh, the short jump. I should probably just make another save over there now. Cause it looks like I might have to keep trying it. <laughs> okay. Save and then let me figure out how this jump works. Hmm. I don't even know if I'm supposed to go there cause I don't see anything there. But, like, why would the spikes be here if you're not supposed to jump for it unless that opens? But I don't know where it opens at. I'm probably spending so much time trying to figure it. 
this jump out that it's actually not even necessary for this part. I had my, I already had my hands out. That just didn't do it. Okay, hang on. That doesn't really make sense. Because the gate's not open. And typically you can't just open the gates. Those are ones that require keys. I still can't get the jump, so. Um, let me look real quick. I haven't seen... Oh. Okay, so I do have to make the jump. At least we got that first. Oh. I did I don't think I knew that this is how you looked at this. Okay. How am I making this jump? It's deceptively a hard jump. Cause you're not. <clears throat> it's weird. It is a very deceptively hard jump because of the way that it's designed. Because it takes a while before your action goes into play, basically. So you can't, you have to take an extra second before you before you reach. So like, see how long it takes her to like raise her arms. I'm already pressing the right trigger after I've jumped. So it has like this weird delay on it. But it, you start already following da falling down when it like activates. So I don't know how the hell I'm supposed to do this, to be honest with you. Hmm. That's such a weird one. I'm out of popcorn and done monkeying around. <laughs> Sounds good, Silverhawk. Thank you for being here. I hope you have a good night. It doesn't trigger the hands. I'm not exactly sure what else I can do. Hmm. Okay, well, we activated the door there. This is where we came from. And the other way is a puzzle that we need a key that I'm assuming we get the key from that side. I don't see anything in here to help me. So I guess I just have to make this jump. But it's like, I don't know exactly how to make this jump, to be honest with you. Now I'm back to mumbling because I'm just trying to figure it out. Hi, mystery one. How are you doing? Good to see you. Thanks, Silverhawk. I'll try. Hi, Casey. How are you doing? Good to see ya. Yeah, it doesn't raise her hands fast enough is the problem. So like, I'm not sure how I'm supposed to make this jump. Cause her hands don't raise quick enough. Let me try the standing one, I guess. I don't know. How far do I go with a standing jump? Oh, I think, okay, I think standing jump is the answer. I just wasn't close enough. I think it's standing jump. It's always penguins. Okay. This one is a weird one. 
Oh, go on. It's okay. It's got to be that. Ugh. I'm just being, I'm just being too impatient. No, that's fair. I know what it's like watching people when they're not getting quite the... Ah, oh, got it, finally. When they're not getting the solution, but... Like Xena said, I'll ask if I ever need it. I just had to exhaust all options. I get there eventually. Or if I don't, then I use pineapple. It is a very particular leap. That was... And again, for modern controls, it's a little bit more difficult because you don't have the backup option. So it's a little like, eh. But we did it. There's so many options to jump. Oops. <laughs> to jump in this game anyway. But we did it. I need to save. <laughs> I need to save so I don't have to try that jump again. I hope that's not. Oh, it shouldn't be timed. But we did it. Ad break is coming in three minutes. Nice. All right, nice and easy. No secrets down there. That was the first thing I thought of as if like one of those popped up and there was like a thing below it. There's a lot of doors in here. Oh, I died quite a few times. I'm gonna switch back. There's keys. There are weird tablets with writing. And a lot of metal doors. There's a key behind that one. There's a rat behind that one. There's a thing. I'm assuming I push it over stuff. Two keys are required to get in there. Okay. All right. <coughs> oh, the save command? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, after that hard jump, you would have thought I would have done it immediately. Okay, so there's four in those spaces. I just wanted to make sure I knew how many there were. So push this over one and see what doors open. At least I'm assuming that's how this works. Yep, I hear something. Climb! Climb, Lara! Yep. Come back here, monkey. There we go. I love that monkeys can't climb. <laughs> Makes perfect sense. I bet, Veliki. Like, I've got become a lot better, and I only fucked up twice today when it terms of, like, saving versus loading. I know. I write Xena? Seriously. It makes no goddamn sense. I'm gonna go with this one first. Hi, Majorus. How are you doing today? D Laura? There we go. <laughs> also, the ad break is starting in approximately 10 seconds, although it doesn't ever seem to be exactly on point. So sometime in the next few moments, there will be another ad. <laughs> I might go use the restroom here in a second. Oh, look at that bullshit. I'm so smart. I didn't even know there was one to the left, but I heard the rolling before I saw the first one roll, and I'm like, nope, keep running. Yay, I'm somewhat smart. I may not understand every puzzle immediately, but I didn't get killed by the boulders. All right. That one's done. And see, I was smart in the order that I did it because that one up there must be that. <laughs> 
Oh, oh ads just started. Hi, Real Magic Cookie. How are you doing? Good to see you. I hope you've been well. Happy Friday Eve, my friends. Yoink. I'll kill these rats because that's fine. And then I'll go use the restroom during the ads. Where was the fourth one? Where's the other one? There it is. There we go. All right. You can appreciate Laura and all of her triangle titty action <laughs> while I go use the restroom. Happy almost Friday. Although <laughs> my Friday is all, all streaming the rest of the weekend, which is fine with me. But my work really begins. Flying to KC tomorrow. What for, Zena? If you don't mind me asking, you don't have to answer, of course. Good old Kansas City. It's been a long time since I've been to that airport. <sighs> oh, you're going to the Kansas City Denver game. That sounds like fun. I hope you have a good time. Ugh. BRB, grabbing a snack. Anybody want something from the kitchen? A drink would be nice. Something other than water. I've been drinking water a lot. I would love a frappe right now, man. I will be right back. I'm going to go use the restroom real quick. Um... Let me turn on music for just a second so you guys aren't just sitting there with nothing. Um, but I'll be right back. Hurting. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. Do you have any cheesecake? I want chocolate, please. I would take something sweet right now. I never got ice cream yesterday. Maybe I'll after this. God, this is so good. I don't want to stop listening to it. Ugh. Hi, JD. How are you doing? <laughs> CD's chair. Sorry, I usually put BRB on the screen or like I could always switch to the, I should have switched to this. You know, the like super expensive scenes that I paid for years ago and half the time I don't even use the BRB screen cause you know, I'm like, oh, I'll only be gone for like a second but maybe I should start use, utilizing that more. But it is Lord of the Rings. This lo-fi playlist is really good. Here, I'll share it with you all. Uh, Mr. Hyper Stifer X shared it with me once. And I am more than happy to share it towards others. Because it's a very cozy lo-fi Lord of the Rings playlist. It's so good. <laughs> and sometimes when I don't know what I want to listen to for games like this, I can try to find, Tomb Raider's music is good. I just need to find the OST on like YouTube, I guess, cause it's not on Spotify. 
but yeah. JD, how are you doing though? It's good to see you. Welcome in. Sorry, I was taking a break and using the restroom. Noshing on a peanut butter and banana sandwich. I used to have a friend that ate that like all the time. That was like their go-to. So. E Blackbird, you're literally speaking my love language right now. <laughs> I would I would love a frappe <laughs> or ice cream or anything right now. It, it's been it's been a last four or five days, JD, if I'm being honest. But um, hopefully things are getting better. Yeah, <laughs> your PRP screen is way more fancy than mine. <laughs> It, uh, I paid for it, that's for darn sure, but I do love my scenes. Like, I 100% love my scenes. Get Wrecked Labs made them. You know what? I'm listening to this for a minute. Until music kicks up in the game again. I have decided. Wait, where did the rats come from? Over here, I think. <laughs> I'm totally listening to Lord of the Rings lo-fi while playing Tomb Raider. That all is right in the world right now. <sighs> At 9 p.m. McDonald's always is Scarlet, but don't. Don't worry about it. There's a reason why I like don't door dash stuff like that. It's insanely expensive. A, like $3 frappe turns into like $10. So no, no, no. It's okay. I appreciate the thought though. That's way too rich for my blood. I was gonna say, I swore I heard something. Yeah, my Spotify thing turned so that as soon as music in the game starts, I'll turn it off. Frappes and fries are like the two things I still would eat at McDonald's. No need to apologize, answer the call of nature. That's fair. I just. <sighs> Chronic apologizer and thank you, -er, I guess. Thanks for being here, JD. It's good to see you. I'm glad things are overall good for you, though. That's good. No, probably not. I don't know if Seven Brew. I've never gotten Seven Brew, though. I really need to try it. I've heard really good things, and it's growing like crazy in the South right now. So. <laughs> That's fair, JD. That's fair. No, you're fine, Scarlet. You're fine. No. You're fine. Oh, it still killed me, really? Also, there's only one key here, what the heck? What? I hadn't saved anything after that. I swore I did. Well, sad day. Rerun for anybody that didn't see it the first time. <laughs> you found a bunch of big finger. I know where you are. I potentially know where you are. I should say it that way, actually. All right, we gotta do this over again. I'll save after I do the four doors because I won't get hurt here. You made it a lot easier on me that time. Was there one or two? I don't remember. Those deadly side spikes. They're definitely not as cool as CD spikes. Yeah, I'm a chronic apologizer and a chronic thank you. 
I think when Lollip raided earlier, probably said thank you five times, and I probably said follow Lollip about ten times. Oh, this is the boulder one, right? Fine, I'll save for the boulder one. Oh, I got nicked because I was going too fast. Oopsies. Okay, I know exactly where Scarlet is right now. Because I know how far she is on the uh, the DLC as well. Scarlet's trying to tell me where she is without, you know, obviously giving big spoilers since Elden Ring's DLC still hasn't been out that long in the grand scheme of things. And clearly we're not even on Elden Ring topic or anything. So she's doing a great job of explaining it to me without, you know, spoiling for others. Press the wrong button. No clue what that's about yet. In due time, my friend, in due time. Oh, really, Charmander? Yeah, they still bring it to like my door here. I just, <laughs> especially now that streaming income is my only income, uh, paying like $10 in delivery fees with, you know, the fee and the tip is way too expensive for my blood. So, I, I do not have that luxury. Hell, even when I had two jobs, I almost never did it. making sure I do I actually cook a decent amount did I cook yesterday I did not cook yesterday. I did cook the day before. I don't cook as good of meals as real magic cookie though but I'm also a picky eater so I definitely cook more at home than I do go out anymore. It used to be the, quite the opposite, but... So wait, did none of these have... Oh, I forgot to go in here. Did none of these have a key? Because that thing has two keyholes. Hmm. Uh, Scarlet, I still haven't yet, and I probably need to soon. I don't know how good, how long that pumpkin's good for. I haven't bought, I haven't bought oatmeal yet. I meant to go this week, but then I didn't leave the house for several days. <laughs> Correction, I went to McDonald's once. But I have everything else I need. I have all the other baking ingredients. I just need the oatmeal for that recipe. Mm -hmm. Oops. I didn't find it. Oh. I don't remember where I got the other key from. <laughs> okay, never mind. I guess I had another key and I don't remember. Oh, gotcha, Charmander. Hey, uh, if it's saving you money. 
you had so much pumpkin puree. See, I'm not a big fan of pumpkin in general, but I did want to try something with, with that pumpkin. Oh, really, Electric Man? Oh, good lord. Yeah, I wouldn't eat very much of that. Aw. You could still do it, Colossus. Oh, that was a weird slash cool angle change. I was very confused for a second. Oh, wait, sorry. Wow, no, 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 fucking alligator, really? Why am I not surprised? Ow, did you just take half my health? You jerk, I was looking at the beautiful scenery. Yep. Kill. Have I died in a while? I can see you a lot better in that light. What a jerk. <laughs> Oh, it was funny because this had like a plant here, so I was like, can I grab that? Maybe that's why they removed it in this one. Just a single random little plant thing. Sounds good, Electric Man. Thanks for being here. I hope you have a wonderful night and happy Friday to you. Hopefully you have some fun plans for the weekend. What do I have on the stream tomorrow? I don't even know. What's tomorrow? Tomorrow is in Discovery Day. Okay. I couldn't actually remember what I had tomorrow. I do have some interesting slash fun um, fun uh, fun games planned. I was telling Llama about the indie games yesterday. And uh, he said it sounded interesting. So Looking forward to sharing with you all tomorrow's in Discovery Day. <coughs> run, Forrest, run! Swim! Swim, Gator, swim! Yep. Uh, oh, not that. So much brighter in the, in the original. Okay, I can't jump that or it's gonna shoot me down there. <coughs> okay. Tomorrow's Friday, it is. Tomorrow is Friday and discovery day for us tomorrow. The what? My arms were out. I'm glad I saved that. My arms were definitely out. What the heck? Anyway, I'm glad you're gonna be hanging out with your friends, Zena. And don't worry, I don't think you're gonna miss anything that I think like really piques your piques your interest. We're going to have the end discovery day tomorrow. And I have some pretty fun, you know, interesting games. I think you will all get a kick out of. We haven't had our end discovery day for, for November yet. I, I didn't even realize I was like consistently doing one per, per month. Uh, but we have been. So I guess this will be November's. And then, um, Saturday is the Twitch streamer tournament thing, which you, if you all haven't heard about that yet, it's being put on by my good friends, Rad Does Games, and we will be participating with 30 different streamers all at once. Um, thanks game for making it sound even more epic. Um, but yeah, we're, we're competing against uh, 29 other content creators just for funsies, but uh, just as a big collaboration event. And so uh, we'll be playing Fall Guys, Fortnite, and Crab Game 
as you all know, I have played my fair share of Fall Guys. Now it has been almost two years since I've launched it. I used to play Fortnite whenever it first came out. Haven't played that since the one sponsored two hour segment I did. And then I've never played Crab Game. So I'm probably going to suck and get eliminated in week one. But I feel like it might be, you know, a fun, a fun thing to root for. Like you guys can come and support me or yell at me and tell me I'm terrible. I don't care. Uh, but I'll be doing that on Saturday. And then Sunday was to be determined. Now is going to be Evil Within 2. I don't know if we'll be able to finish it, but I wouldn't mind trying to make an effort to see if we can get it done that day. I do like Evil Within 2. But it's probably... It, we might be able to finish it on Sunday if we have like a long, long stream on Sunday, but I'm not sure. We'll see where we're at. And then that's why next week I was like, we might be able to go ahead and start cyberpunk and or mass effect next week or at least we'll be really close I, i'm sure we'll start one of them next week but like i said there's a lot of other stuff you all don't know about that i've been working in the background we have a lot of fun events coming up is how i will word it at least i think they're fun and hopefully others will end up enjoying them too Some silly stuff with some amazing people, pretty much, is the best way to word it. Okay, can't go in here. Did I get something in my inventory? No. It just popped me out here. I have to pull a lever or something. I did something, but what did that do? We got cool music coming in here, but I don't... The door's not open. It popped us out there. I figured the lever I did would have, like, opened that door. That would have made sense. Unless I'm just, like, misremembering. Did I not actually, open, like, trigger a lever? I am confuzzled. Oops, accidentally paused chat. Probably gonna play some more Dragon Age. Very nice, Real Magic Cookie. I hope you've been enjoying it. Oh, you have Monday and Tuesday off as well? That's nice, Real Magic Cookie. I'm glad you have a nice long weekend. I hope life has been shaping up a little better for you. I've heard a lot of good things about uh, J Veilguard, so. Ew. Ew, Biv. I'm sorry. That sounds terrible. <laughs> well, I probably won't win anyway. I, I've never even played Crab Game. And they let us know like a week in advance like what the games we were going to be playing were, was this week. A and I could practice, but <laughs> I I'm, I'm just there to have a good time with other people. Maybe get to know some new people, hang out with people that I do know. You know, that kind of thing. I'm... No, I did pull that. Didn't I? Or no, did I miss? I did pull that. What did that do for me then? Yeah, I pulled this, but I don't know what that did for me. Well, I'm sure I need to have it pulled because why else would it be here? But this makes it you so you can get back over here. But why? Why would you want to? Why would you need to? Um, I don't know. I'm missing something. What am I missing, game? Oh god, that's so bright. Oof. Camera angles. Yeah, what does that do for me? Am I 
I pulled the lever. And I would have expected that to open the door or open a pathway or something, because you didn't even hear anything move. Maybe that's a debate. Maybe... I think that would be stupid, but maybe you weren't supposed to pull it yet. And so by doing so, I closed the door? I don't... But that doesn't make any sense. I guess I could go undo it. Because, yeah, this doesn't have anything. Alright, just out of curiosity. Alright, sorry. Crab Game is an experience even from my outside perspective. I've never watched Squid Game, and I know that Crab Game was like loosely based around that. It's like a little free party game, but I never played it. Yeah, fun, Viking, fun. And a wintering lottery ticket for Celestrea. It's unfortunately only a $5 ticket. Man, Robco brought back all sorts of lovely things. You just said snacks, and you're bringing back lottery tickets. Hell yeah. Strawberry daiquiri sounds incredible, actually. <laughs> that is true, Blaster. Five bucks from nothing is still definitely worth it. Yeah, that's just that sounds terrible, Biv. That's annoying, to say the least. No, you're fine, Veliki. Thanks for being here. Thanks for watching. I appreciate you. Uh, it's all three this week, Robco. So the games will change next week if I move on to the next round. So basically, there's three three weeks of it. Now, it's not all back to back to back. It's spread out. It's every other week, basically. So this week is the first week. Um, it's a point system. We do two hours of Fortnite, two hours of Fall Guys, and two hours of Crab Game. Points are tallied based off of different objectives in each game. Basically, the higher you score uh, and... In Fortnite, it's how many eliminations you get also adds points. And so then they calculate the point totals and then the bottom 10 are eliminated. And then the two weeks from now will be the next round of the 20 people left. And then finally the 10 people left. I, I think I mentioned it before, but if I end up uh, getting cut before the last week, I won't be super upset about it because that's the weekend of my birthday. Now, if I do something on my birthday, it won't really matter. But usually people have an easier time making it on a Saturday or Sunday. So I usually tend to do something on those days. But if I need to celebrate on my birthday this year, that's fine, too. So... <laughs> yep. Yep. Fair, Scarlet. You want to know a fun fact? I didn't even find that area until after I could navigate that door, so it wasn't even there for me. So I didn't even know it stopped people. <laughs> I only found that out after I played. Yeah, same, Robco. Hey, I'll definitely take a strawberry daiquiri. That sounds wonderful. Okay, let me see what the hell this does. Because I triggered it, but it didn't seem to do anything. Like, open a door or anything else? Which doesn't make sense because it's there. So maybe the door was already open and I... No? What the hell does that switch do? Or anything for that matter. Okay, I'm very confused right now because there's literally only this door. I've swam all the way around the bottom area and I do not see any other exits or doorways or passageways or otherwise. I see absolutely nothing. Okay, hang on. Let me do this then. Load that. Okay, I'm gonna leave that. Flanker. 
My friend. What are you doing up so late? Like, this is later than even normal for you. Hello. How are you? You need to get you some rest, my friend. I appreciate you raiding me, but what the heck? How are you? How is your stream? How is Call of Duty? Welcome in, everyone. My name's CD, for those that don't know me. I'm a variety game streamer from Arkansas in the US, and we are playing some Tomb Raider 1. I have never played Tomb Raider 1 before. I've never played any Tomb Raider, really, except for a random little game on the Game Boy Advance. Or sorry, not Game Boy Advance, Game Boy Color. Um, I am wildly confused at the moment. Because, yeah, we dropped down there. The only thing we could do was the switch. I am wildly confused right now. I'm going to go back there one more time, and if I can't figure it out, then I'll have to ask for a pineapple. Not yet, though. Let me check one more thing. Hi, Akel. Hi, Flanker. Hello, Soul Shinery. How are you doing? It's good to see you. Playing some late night Call of Duty DMZ with the community for some silly fun after K. I almost said it again. CK3. Sounds good. Did you get some winner winner chicken dinners? I know that's PUBG, but still. Did you get some wins in the Call of Duties? <laughs> yeah, I don't see anything. I'm wildly confused right now. Cause that's what the flip or the switch flipped. Am I missing like is there a passage over here? No, I'm so confused. Hi unholy cookie, how are you doing? Everybody, please go check out the wonderful, the awesome, I'm a flanker. Good friend and a wonderful streamer. Plays a wide variety on their channel, mostly focused on community-based games. They play everything with their community from Crusader Kings 3 to Call of Duty to Played Up to Farming Sim to Project Zomboid to like you name it. If there is a multiplayer element, they play it together. It is a really fun time. I really enjoy my time around Flanker's community. So please go check him out if you have not done so already. And of course, I know that it is, you know, a wee bit early in the morning for you, Flanker. So if you do need to read and run, take care of anything, please do so. Okay, I... I might actually be stumped on this one. I might actually be stumped on this one. I think my sub just ran out. I, I've totally done that way too many times. Unholy cookie, I've, I've totally had that happen. Well, it's good to see you. Uh, welcome in. Won some, lost some, and finally lost to Cheater, which made me think I might <laughs> it might be time to call it. Oh Lord, that's annoying. Okay, well, speaking of calling it, I, I don't see anything. I, I literally, I don't, there's nothing else here. There's the one switch, there's a door, and no, no, it kind of looked like you could move that almost. At least in the old version. There's just a bunch of emptiness everywhere. Which just has me so freaking confused. Sounds good, Xena. Thanks for coming in. Enjoy your book and uh, give Argo some extra love for me. All right, I, I've hit my limit on this. I don't know. I am very, very confused on this. If anybody has a hint on what to do, I, I'm i stumped. There's one switch. I don't know what the switch does. I tried coming in here both with it on and off. 
The door remains closed regardless of me switching the switch. I don't see anything else. Like, I ran around, swam around for a long time. I don't see anything. So, if anybody is familiar. If anybody is not familiar, then I'll just end stream here. <laughs> but I, uh, I, I don't see anything. I don't understand what the switch is for. That's definitely confusing me. Because you don't hear any changes. I don't see any changes when I flip the switch. It made me think it was broken at first because I was like, there, it needs to open something. It needs to activate something, but I don't see anything that it's doing. The only thing here is that Viv, I think you made that joke already. Yeah, I... I would have figured the switch would have just opened that door, but that seems too straightforward, but at the same time, there's nothing else. I don't see anything else. Well, I might just have to come back and think on it with a fresh mind. We have already been streaming for almost six hours anyway, so I don't see anything else. Like I've I've looked all around, I've swam all around. I think we're just stuck for the moment. There's nothing else in here. You don't hear any sounds. It's weird that they would have you jump back, but I still don't see anything back this way. I was like, maybe if I go backwards, but no, I don't see anything. Well, unfortunately, I think I'm just stuck. And since we're almost at six hours anyway, probably a good time to call it. I mean, the last time that I got stuck, I literally just reloaded in the next day and then I figured, well, I say the next day, the next time I streamed it, I figured it out. But yeah, I don't know. I, I can't figure this one out. I don't see anything else to interact with unless I'm just wildly blind. But that's fine. Be dear. Never watched Highlander. I think I have the movie. Gummy. All right. Well, that's that. <sighs> All right, there we go. There we go. All right. Well, that was some more Tomb Raider. I, I really am enjoying Tomb Raider a lot. It's a little bit of a shame I couldn't figure that part out. I might have to look it up or try and give it another glance next time we play it. Speaking of which, I honestly don't know the next time we'll play Tomb Raider. It's definitely going to be sometime this coming week because I do want to finish Tomb Raider uh, before like entering both other big RPGs. So I'll probably finish it first and then um, and then start our big playthroughs. I don't even know. We did the cistern. What was that other level we were just on? Tomb Raider. Okay, that's not gonna help. 
know that's 2013's version. I knew that was going to be a pain. I was trying to see how many, uh, how many chapters there was, but... Thank you for being here, Rob Kim. Thank you to everybody for hanging out today. Let me uh, find somebody lovely to raid and also thank everybody else. Thank you very much to Dimples, Lollip, and Flanker for the raids today. I appreciate the heck out of you all for wanting to bring your communities over here. It means the world to me. Thank you for the resubs. We had quite a few today, and I think that's due to me not being live the last three days. Uh, thank you for the new follows and the bits. Thank you to the mods for moderating as they do and keeping the community safe. Uh, let me do some perusing and find somebody to raid you all to. Mm -hmm. Ooh, how long has Kay Merkel been on for? I just see that she's playing Cult of the Lamb. I haven't raided her in a while either. Man, it's been a while. I, I want to play Cult of the Lamb again. You know what? We're just gonna straight do that because that sounds wonderful. Uh, we're gonna raid Miss Kay Merkel, who is a sweetheart of a lady, by the way. Uh, I met her at TwitchCon. She was wonderful. Oh God, I almost accidentally unfollowed her. I would've been super upset. I'm so glad it gives you the, are you sure? Cause I was trying to click out of the damn tab. Let me click out of it. There we go. <laughs> I think that's a weird issue with uh, Windows 11. It keeps trying to like keep my thing up. I would have been so upset, Robco. <laughs> Cause I, I was trying to click off of something and I clicked the heart on accident. I would have been very upset. But uh, it'll be a very fun stream cause she is playing Cult of the Lamb uh, with the Twitch integration. And if you all were around when I did my Cult of the Lamb, the Twitch integration stuff was great. And they've actually since improved upon it. You can actually create your character ahead of time so that if you do get into the cults, you already have your character created, which is nice because you're not waiting on people. Uh, you can actually even play the mini game, the little dice rolling game um, against uh, K Merkel and some other stuff. So it's really, really cool. So stick around. Um, we'll raid over to K Merkel since it's been a while since we've said hi to her and you all can enjoy some Cult of the Lamb, hopefully. So, hi, Sir Cosmo. I hope you're doing well today. Thanks, Biv. I hope you have a good one. I hope you all have a wonderful evening. Thanks for being patient with me. I know I don't have to say that, but um, sorry, I have been a little distant the last few days. I'm still kind of dealing with some stuff, but I, I'm feeling better. Uh, I'm feeling better. So, there's a lot of interesting stuff coming on the horizon. I look forward to telling you all very soon. Um, some I can talk about now. Some I have to wait, but... Uh, there's, there's a lot of cool things that I'm excited to share with you all in the future. So uh, let's, let's get this kicked off, though. And of course, stick around in K Merkel's and you might get indoctrinated into the cults. And she might force you to make, like, to eat poop. I'm not sure, but uh, she might do that. So just a heads up. I'm starting to feel back to normal, Glass Joe. I'm starting to. But anywho, uh, thank you all so much for being here. Seriously, whether you lurked or you chit-chatted or anything in between, whether you monetarily supported the channel, I appreciate having every single one of you here. Thank you for valuing my time. I value your time so much. Um, and yeah, gonna raid you over to K Merkel. Have a good one, Wesley. Take care, Real Magic Cookie. Thanks for being here, Glass Joe. Take care, Blaster. Have a good one, Robco. Robco's posted the raid messages, but there's the raid messages again. Um, Biv, thanks for being here. Sarah Cosmo, thank you for being here. But yeah, everybody have a good morning, a good afternoon, a good evening, or a good night, whatever it is where you all are. And I will catch you all next time. I will be live tomorrow at 11 a.m. Central Daylight Time. Sorry, Central Standard Time. My apologies, it's changed. Uh, Central Standard Time, so minus six UTC, and we will be here with In Discovery Day. It's going to be a very interesting in Discovery Day, so um, you, you may want to come and watch that one. I think there's going to be some, some stuff I think you all would get a kick out of. So we have three to four games that I'll be showcasing tomorrow. But yeah, thanks for being here. Have a good one, Llama. Take care, Scarlet.
Bye, everybody. Bye, Celestrea. <laughs>